hello, hello. How are you guys doing? Happy Friday. It is Friday. It is the weekend. And happy Saturday to our Aussie fam. Um, let's see who's here. Allison, welcome in. Welcome in. Are you having an amazing birthday week, Allison? I hope you are. D Sims, Becca, Irish. How is everyone? Oh my goodness, you guys. I've got to like, Rose, happy Saturday to you, Rose. I've got to like shift my energy a little bit. I just had like, so like I told you guys, like I'm going through a breakup and I like, it feels weird saying like my ex-boyfriend, like I still want to say like my boyfriend, but it's like not my boyfriend, but we like live together still, but we have separate rooms just for a few months. And I just like ran into him outside and I hadn't seen him in a few days. And it kind of like threw me off a little bit. So I just got to like, shift my energy and get into stream vibes. D Sims a little saucy, but you're good. Miss Colt, hi, how are you? Drill Sergeant, ranching must be in Steven's blood because he loves to be a rancher. I love that for Steven, love that. Bee Bear, hello. Oh my goodness. I, I'm, my nose is already itching. I'm gonna have to take allergy medicine again. Mama Zip streamer, happy Friday. Oh my gosh, does anybody have any big, exciting weekend plans? I know we just got out of the holiday, so if by big plans I mean like staying in and relaxing. <laughs> Mushy, welcome in. D Sims, you may or may not have had a little too much grown up juice. Uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> Love that for you. It doesn't feel like Friday. It feels weird because like Monday was a holiday, and then this was my first week adjusting to like a part time work schedule. And then the last three nights, I have not been able to sleep. I've been having like really, really bad insomnia. Like I'm, I've been up to like, I was literally like watching Devin Bumpkin build videos at like 3.30 a.m. this morning, like trying to fall asleep and like finally fell asleep. So my week feels like, it feels weird. It's like, it doesn't feel like Friday, but we need to, we need to shift that and get into like Friday, Friday mode. Um... Surprise beauty party got revealed to you when your out of town friends had an unexpected expense, so they stayed uh, staying with you tomorrow instead of a hotel. That's exciting. That is exciting. Oh, Miss Colt, you missed when I shared that before and didn't want to <laughs> ask. Yeah, that's that's what's happening. I'm going through a bit of a breakup at the moment, um, which was my choice. I I decided that, but it doesn't make it still. You know, it's still emotional. Still emotional. Um, yeah, short week, G Sim, so it doesn't feel like Friday. My contacts are kind of blurry, you guys, so I'm like, <laughs> I don't know why that happens with my contacts, why I sometimes can't read stream. Uh, Irish, uh, you're still cleaning up the house from the mess. You had family for a while, didn't you, Irish? Is everybody, everybody's gone back home now? Because you were hosting, like, over the whole holidays, I think you said in Discord. Mm. Marijuana, you're quitting nicotine vaping so you feel the insomnia. Yeah, I actually, I've vaped for a really long time and I've been trying to quit too. I like did pretty good for like a month and then this whole like breakup thing kind of got to me and so I like picked it back up. But I feel you, sending you all the good vibes because it's hard. That is really, really hard. But anyways, anyways, all right. We're gonna play some decades today and we have some fun stuff. We have weddings that need to happen and Sims that need to grow up and move on and all of the things. So we can get into it. Oh, did you redeem a hydrate? Hold on, why is it not showing up on my, I feel like some, I don't know if it's cause I'm in like a weird like vibe right now. Okay, okay, alerts are working. I was test if my alerts are working. Thank you, G-Sims, for a thousand bits. The alerts are in fact working. And there they go. Okay. I didn't see the hydrate, but I am gonna go ahead and hydrate anyway. Yep, we've got James's wedding, so we're gonna switch the screen over. Um, Amanda, hello, hello. Welcome in, welcome in. Let's see. What are we doing? You can screenshot and show me later. Yes, definitely. Please do if you want to like post it in Discord or wherever. 
Um, but I believe you. I just wanted to make sure my stream was working because Twitch has been Twitch has been a little bit glitchy for everyone lately. So um yeah, I don't know why that never showed up on my my redeem list. Anyways, thanks for letting me know. You've got um Miss Cole, you've got me in one we're air and wistful in the other. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Yes, you guys, wistful is on right now. I'm gonna get I'm gonna give her another I'm gonna give her another shout out. If you guys have not checked out Wistful stream, Wistful Cactus, who he hangs out with us here. Oh my gosh, she is hilarious. She's playing Hunter Baby right now. We're gonna give her another shout out. If any of you guys wanna go over and say hi while we're getting started, but she hit her 50, she'll be affiliate soon. We're so excited for her. Back over you hanging out with Wistful. I've been hanging out with Wist Wistful and Becca Boo like on my days where I'm not streaming and I've been having the best time, best time over there. So if I'm not on and you see they're on, you guys definitely go hang out and say hi. I'll probably be in the chat. James's wedding. Yeah, Be Betty's actually got to probably age up first. I think I want Betty to be a teenager at the wedding. So I think also, where are all of my Sims? <laughs> I was like, where is everyone? Um, I did play like a little bit off of cam. I need to double check with that I didn't actually play a whole year because I was just trying to get reconnected with this family. Okay, I can't see you guys in chat right now real quick while I'm looking at, well, here, let me bring the spreadsheet over here so I can see, so I can see you guys. Monica, happy weekend. Yes, all the Sims are sad and I'll tell you why in just a second. But calendar wise, I think the game said it was Sunday. I had that, okay, it's the first day of 1871. So I played a little bit of 1870. I didn't really do a lot. Let's update it. Do, 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 do. I was feeling a little uninspired with these guys. So I just like played them for a few days just to kind of get in a groove with them and kind of move a few things ahead. And while I was doing that, Goldie, Gold, well, Goldie, Gold Rush, our horse Gold Rush died. And that's when I stopped. As soon as Gold Rush died, I, um, I was like, oh, no, I don't want everyone to miss anything. And I'm kind of glad that didn't happen on stream because honestly, the horse stuffs are like so sad. So I'm really sorry that you guys um, missed that. But that's why everyone is sad. Um, let me hold on. I'm going to turn on slow mode for chat because you guys, I'm, I'm not keeping up today. I'll get back in a groove. Let's just go slow mode for a little while. Let me slow you guys down. Slow your roll. Slow your roll. Wistful said thank you. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Um, if I miss anything that you guys wanted me to see, just feel free to always drop it back in. <laughs> drop it back in there again. And just yell at me nicely. <laughs> yell nicely. And I'll get to it. Um... Enjoy your lurk, Mel B. Okay, so yeah, we missed the horse dying. So I'm sorry you guys missed that. And then I just did a little bit of stuff with Betty's um, aspirations. She got a few more aspirations ticked off to give us, give her some more bonus points. And that's pretty much really all that happened. I just was kind of getting back into a groove with them. But we are going to start off with aging Betty up into a teenager because I want her to be a teen when we do the wedding. And I want your guys' ideas on what we'll do for the wedding. I was thinking we would just do like a really simple like sort of backyard wedding at the Native American lot where like the, all the teepees are. Like maybe we can set up like an arch. I am not doing my wedding stories wedding. Not at all, not at all. Um, Monica. Happy two months, happy two months, and hello, Mel, welcome in. Uh, let's see, so let's see who's up for the day first. Okay, you're creepily watching over your, uh, what is, is she a toddler now? Yeah, yeah, Josie's a toddler. Yeah, we're gonna do a simple wedding. We're gonna get James moved out. And if you guys weren't at the last stream, and I'm really behind on getting my replays up to YouTube. So if you guys normally catch replays there, they are delayed. I have like three, I think like three or four streams I need to upload, but not a lot has been happening. My game was kind of messed up for a while. 
Um, so really only last stream, I feel like, is the one that's kind of like worth watching in my opinion. But I decided that James is not going to take over the farm. Um, wait, do we already have food? I was going to have her come make breakfast, but there's already biscuits and gravy apparently. Okay, fantastic. James, what are you doing? Because you're up. Let's go get a bath. Um, so James, I decided, I think I want to play Gen 2 at the lot. I think we might change it up. We might like remodel the house or like continue to add on to the house. I don't really want this whole like area where the horses were. Like now that both of the horses died, like I love the horses in the game, but I just don't have enough time to do a lot with them. So I don't know. We might re... I, I don't know. We're going to change stuff up, but I want Jin 2 to stay on this lot, I think. And we've got to decide who the heir is going to be. Because I don't know if it's going to be Wyatt anymore. We'll see. Um, You keep jumping in here and then watching the streams back later when you've got nothing else to do and just skip the bits you've seen. That makes sense. So basically, you don't know what the heck is going on. Oh, I wanted to add a channel redemption. Hold on. I can't keep up with where my sims are. I got two sims awake. Okay, good. Betty's awake. Betty, come. I'm going to end up cheating their sadness away too because they stay sad for like two days and it's like too much. Um, Madison, why don't you come make a cake so we can actually do a cake for Betty? Can we not serve breakfast? Cook. We'll make a honey cake if we can. Yeah, and so Rose, instead of moving the cow shed over, one of the things I want to do is maybe switch from using the cow shed to using the Lot 51 free range. So I'm using that in my Ultimate Decades, and I really like that mod. It's got like a lot, like other little side things that happen. Like, I don't know, mushrooms start to grow and like different things. I don't know, it's kind of cool. And I haven't really had a chance to play with it a lot. So I was like, maybe I'll do that and we'll get like a couple of cows. Oh no. Oh, we don't have honey for that cake. Okay, so can I make a... Yeah, we'll just make a white cake. Annie's first time watching. She should just sit through you a tennis court. And I did it. And she's been hooked ever since. Yeah, that's a lot of space we could do something with for sure. And like, I actually, when I was rebuilding my save file and I saw the lot or saw the house that was originally on this lot, it's like a massive house and it's built in the back of the lot and then all of the farm stuff was in the front so i was like we could maybe just completely rethink like i kind of don't want to change it that much like i still wanted to feel like the original structure was maybe here but i don't know we've got lots of room to play with for the next generation because i'm not sure exactly what we'll do gameplay wise betty's like mom mom is my cake ready go join the cooking Where'd my water go? Oh no, we're so sad. We're so sad! Come here, Betty. And that um, sink wasn't working, so I took that sink out and I put this tiny little sink in here just because I like the vibe of it. But I don't know. We might switch that too. Um, if I'm up for it, it would be fun crossover if I were to build a new home to set this house on fire for storytelling purposes. Yeah, I was like thinking about things like that, Rose. I was like, is there something we could do? Like, there's like, we have so many options. We have so many options. Wait, are you, are you guys still talking about the, the, you guys are saying stairs. You guys are still talking about the 1920s mansion, aren't you? Oh boy. I'll never forget. I honestly feel like I remember the first time you were there, Becca. It was you and Ash were like, <laughs> you and Ash were like the whole stair, stair gate. Yeah. Stair again whatever we want to call it. Oh God. It was a thing, but they did come out. That build took me like 30 hours. 30 hours and it was still just a big box. Um, all right, it's time. We're not gonna worry about all of your siblings being here. <laughs> Cause I wanna see what she's gonna look like. Our little red haired baby girl. Happy birthday, Betty. Oh my gosh. The neighbor is just started blasting music and it's like my baby, my chair. 
I can't. I was just like, oh my god. I felt like I had like one of those massage chairs. Where are you going? Where'd she go? Where are we going to age up? No one else did this, Betty. No one else insisted on going outside. I see that hydrate. I do see that one. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That one, that one came through. All right, what is she? I forgot she was art lover. I feel like that doesn't really suit her that much. She's definitely a goofball, for sure. Definitely very confident is our girl. Um, what would be a good, like, adult trait for her? She's very, like... She's a bro, you feel like? I could kind of see that. The way she's been acting this whole time. Like, farting in front of her crush. And, like, she's just not very ladylike. Um, yes, Jill Sergeant, we're gonna, we're gonna, we'll go in and we'll make sure Frankie gets aged up too, because, um, that's gonna for sure be her, her hubs. Um, oh my God, should we make her a bro? Cause that would give her a lot of funny, like interactions for, um, like social interactions. Where is it? Isn't it? I thought it was under this last tab. Are these not in ABC order? No, here it is. Here it is. Okay, I think that would fit her. Let me know if anyone has any other suggestions. And then I'm starting to pay attention to the aspirations more now. I feel like I'm I'm starting. I was never like a, ooh, I want to check boxes off type player. But like I said, right now, while I'm kind of like going through a lot, it just, it's helpful for me to not have to think so much. Um, Originally, she was kind of a farm girl, but I, I kind of want to make her a joke star. What are the teen ones? Or the live fast? The Sim just wants to get the most out of life. Living carefree and rules free. Maybe we'll do that one. And then what's the bonus trait on that? Relatable Sims build friendly relationships with fellow teens faster. Um, sure. Sure, we'll go with that. We can always change oh. it. Oh, no, you would say she could swap out the artistic, but not in cast. Like like us not manually switch it like let her let it like the end game what are, what are those called self wait what does the game call them what an outfit for some reason this household the sims like their chins are very undefined this is probably, I don't know, like, they've been, like, my least favorite in terms of, like, their facial structure when they age up. I don't know why why none of my sims have a chin. Let's go in. How, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. I can safely go into cast and not accidentally delete anyone. Self-discovery. I was so close. I was, like, self, self, uh, <laughs> self-discovery. Okay, let's do another a little, little save. save. Is it Madison's chin? Madison's lack of chin? I made Madison very quickly when I was making love interests, so maybe I didn't give her the best facial facial structure. Well, we'll we'll do what we can because I don't like to change what they look like too much. What are these pants? I think she has like double pants on. We did say she was a bro. That's her cold weather. Oh, that's her. <laughs> okay, Betty. You've got very like 1920s hair going. Like, look at her. Like, look at her neck compared to her lack of chin. <laughs> like, what is happening? Betty, we're going to have to take you into the. She is very cute. And it keeps giving her. She keeps inherit. They all keep inheriting a skin detail that is like. How do I even give you a chin? This profile is like, I don't normally change them very much, but she, it, no. She does have a really long neck. Betty, you don't even look like Betty to me. Let's tone that neck down a little. I just, 
I want to click one of these things, but then I'm scared it's going to change her face like a lot. Oh god, it's getting worse. Betty, I don't know what to do. <laughs> oh no. Better to adjust it from detail mode. Okay, Rose or D Sims, let's uh You're the cast master, so she will be fine. I might have to work on her later cuz I don't mess with this very much. D Sims, I'm gonna have to upload her to the gallery after and let you work magic on her and then upload her back to me. <laughs> I'm gonna send her to your lab so you can fix my baby girl. What have they done to her? I don't wanna mess her up, so I don't wanna do too much. Let's just see if we can. Oh boy. I'm not kidding, D Sims. I am gonna upload her for you. And then <laughs> I'm gonna send her your way. I'll just fix her relationships when she comes back like I did before. It won't be that hard. Frankie will love her anyway. I love that. I love that. Frankie will love her no matter what. I wanna give her a little bit of like slightly messier eyebrows. Can I make Sims for this challenge? You can. I have a, I have a, um, what do you call it? I have a hashtag, Cosmic Hippie Townies. I have not checked it in a long time, and I know a lot of, if any of you are watching and you've uploaded it, I apologize if you've created Sims and I haven't brought them into the game yet. We just haven't really needed any Sims yet, so I haven't checked it for a while, but I feel like we're getting to a point in the series where having some new friends and stuff would be really nice. Okay, just adding the eyelashes, honestly, is already helpful. Um, and I think I'm still going to send her to D-Sims just to see what sort of plastic surgery Dr. D-Sims can do to her. Oh, yeah, yeah. I kind of want her to have, like, the wild curly hair. Like, she doesn't even tie it back. It's just curly. Lashes do work wonders. The chin does look better. And honestly, now that she's got hair, she's not looking so bad. Actually, now she's looking cute. She's got a really nice round face. You uploaded your 1850s house with a hashtag Cosmic Hippie Builds. I cannot wait. I'm going to have to dr drop that into game. I also am going to, uh, this weekend, I want to start working on, oh my god, the little bangs are kind of super cute. I want her to just be messy. I feel like it might be a little too much. Um, may make a sim who's a little futuristic, not necessarily from the future, but one that dresses different from the current time period, but not so much different, like a lady who wears pants. Since ladies started wearing pants around this time, I had a sim that wore pants in my first decades challenge, and she was a lot of fun. I kind of like this with the curls. Um, she will just need a husband with a strong jaw and their kids will be fine. We'll have to check on Frankie's jaw when we go in. Drill Sergeant, does Frankie have a solid jaw? Because... Becky's, uh, Becky, Bet Betty's kids are, um, they need a strong jaw for sure. For the genetics. I'm going to go with that hair for just a minute. Custom content. Probably give her, like, different swatches of this dress that Betty had. I mean, that. Okay, she's supposed to be younger. I feel like I need to, like, tone down her assets just a little bit. Because she's looking a little mature for her teenage years. Well, we can give her a pants outfit too. I'll give her a dress, like a farm girl dress for her main outfit. Hmm. Yeah, maybe just like a little blue, a little, a little blue top. Let's see, where am I? 
Wild West shoes. There they are. Okay. Can't even see them. Should I don't know if I've got what I've got that could work. She's been sneaking a little extra at dinner time. Yeah, I always bring it down a little bit, like just because I um one, I don't like it when the CC glitches, and two, I just like I make my Sims eat even when they're not hungry and it has its effects on them. He's got a jaw and a chin. Okay, drill sergeant. Good. Good, because we're gonna need it. We are going to definitely need it. I wish I had like those Batu pants for children, but for adults. Because I don't know that I'm going to have anything to sort of fit the time period to put her in pants. So I might just have to have a little play around after stream. Okay, let's think about her formal. Normally, I don't spend a lot of time on this, but they're going to be going to the wedding. So I need to actually do... Oh, yeah, the chaps could work. The chaps could work, Rose. That's a good idea. Um, What do we think she'll wear to James's wedding? Oh, wait, we have something like this. I didn't realize... This is, like, actually, like, a pretty, like, cool option as well. I quite like this. I didn't even know I had that. Ah. Have I ever tried? I have not tried that. Uh, fitness controls. It makes it so that Sims weight gain and loss are more realistic. I need that, D Sims. I need that. I like this. And then uh, let's see what she looks like with the little cowboy hat on. I'm just loving the cowboy hats. Very, very much so. So let's try. Maybe not that one. Yeah, like an actual cowboy hat. Look at her girl. It looks like it could be Wyatt's outfit that she borrowed. Every <laughs> poor Wyatt's not gonna have any clothes left. All the all the sisters are wearing Wyatt's clothes. Um. Okay. I think I like this. We have to get this is her formal. I'm gonna set this for what she's gonna wear to the wedding. Um. But let's give her that in in her every day as well. Okay. It was this one. Are there any other? Swatches. I kind of like the swatch that we had. The little, the green. Hmm. I think the green looks really nice with her red hair. His sisters are taking his clothes. They sure are. And then let's do those little. Where were the? These were the boots I put her in. Those little boots. Definitely the cowboy hat. The cowboy hat was a nice accessory. Oh my god! I want Betty to be the heir now. I actually kind of, I'm not going to lie, Betty's been my favorite since the beginning. And then my favorite is always the goofball sim, like always. I was thinking Annie Oakley too, plus red hair, plus red hair. I should actually make it a rule in my challenges that if there are any red hair, the only eligible heirs are the children that had red hair. Unless one of the other ones just is like a standout favorite. You must have red hair to pass on to the next round. <laughs> Otherwise, you are eliminated. Does that seem fair? <laughs> hmm. Musical airs. Be Betty is your fave too, Marijuana. I just love the goofball. And if we're going to go with her, like, I think she'll still get married. But if we're going to go with, like, she kind of, she's like, um, I think she's going to, she's kind of like William. Like, she's going to cause some trouble. Like, she's going to be a little bit wild. Wild Betty. Okay, I think that outfit will work. Um, oh my. She's got a piercing and everything on this one. Athletic, I will just do... Wait, there was something that... Oh, you were saying chaps, Rose. That's right, it was. You had said the, the, the chaps. Maybe that could go under her 
athletic for riding horses. Well, we don't even have any horses right now, but in the event that we got some horses, Rule number one in Shay's streams, airs are fluid. You got that, Sims. Your position is not set in stone. It's very true. It's very true. Because the reason why, Rose, that I think I've gotten that way is when I very first started streaming and I was doing Decades Challenge, um, I, we had, I think, six kids and we had all girls except for the youngest was finally a boy. And I had two favorite Sims out of the girls and the boy was like probably my least favorite of all of the Sims. And I picked the male heir just based on the rules. And it was my biggest regret to this day because I did not enjoy generation two like at all. Um, and I just don't want to make that mistake again. I want to make sure that I genuinely like the Sim. Otherwise, I just, like, you have to play that generation for quite a while, and to not like The Sim is not, uh, not good. So I'd rather just change my mind and go with the one that I really want. Huh. These colors are just so vibrant. Maybe something like that for her. I feel like she's giving me rancher vibes. She could totally take over the farm. Yeah, you don't like strict rules. Just pick my fave for sure. Um, Let's see. I missed some messages. So if you guys need to repost anything. Time for an accident. Remove the air so the next can take over. The other thing I was, okay, sorry. I'm going really slow right now because I'm having trouble chit-chatting and s simming at the same time. Um, another thing, now I lost my train of thought. What was yeah. I thinking? What was, the, what was the other thing I was thinking? Hold on, it'll come back to me. Giving Sadie, wait, who is Sadie Adler? Who is that? Give me context. Should I know who that is? Cowboy hat. Do any of these other ones look good on you? Oh, Red Dead, Red Dead Redemption 2. I don't know um, the characters from that. Do they have red hair as well? Oh, I think... I can't remember if this is what I was going to say, but this is one of the things I was thinking. So one, uh, while I was playing off cam, I did have William making a lot of nectar. And uh, we have like a ton of nectar incubating. That's not the right word, but incubating in the, in the um, basement. So we are going to be... Basically, I need a lot of money because I don't want to cheat any money for any of the side households either. Like, I want to be able to, like, give them the money that they're going to need to, like, have a house. Well, I guess the the females I wouldn't need to necessarily. But, like, well, I guess, I don't know. I guess we're not going to need that much money because James is going to move on to the Native American lot. We don't have to pay for that. Um, But either way, we're about to be rich. It's called aging. Thanks, Rose. <laughs> I couldn't think of the word in the moment. So I was just like incubating. I was like, that's not the right word. It's not an egg, but you know, whatever. Um, party, I'm just going to put her in that pants outfit again because I'm vibing this outfit so much that I just want to see her in this all of the time until I'm tired of it and don't want to see it anymore. So for the sake of time... Ooh, there's the Sadie outfits. You know what? Do I have the Sadie outfits in my game? I guess, are these, hold on. Is this one of them? Are these the Sadie outfits? You said smart abilities instead of intelligence once, you know? My brain, it, it's not braining all the time, but I have these three outfits. I think these outfits, or maybe it's this one. I don't know. I think those are all from uh, Red Dead Redemption or whatever the heck it's called. Um, I think. 
but these are cool. Yeah, those are the ones. Sweet. Frankie will share his clothes with Betty so she will stop stealing Wyatt's. That's so nice of him. I kind of want to put her in this outfit because I do want to see this outfit more. What is this? This is party wear. Um, that is so fetch. Oh my god, I totally forgot I put a couple new sounds in. I'm testing out another website that I saw Wistful um, ha was setting up. And there it's a lot easier to look for um, sounds and stuff. So I'm going to try it out. I don't know if you guys could hear it. The You can't like adjust the audios on them, which is really annoying. Or at least I haven't figured out how. And it's like turned up on my stream already. I'm taking my sweet, precious time here. Not a bad she volume. Okay. Go here. <laughs> There's a couple new ones. I actually have a ton of them bookmarked to see. I just don't know what kind of stuff like would be fun. Here, we'll just do that hat for now. Uh, swim. Um, we're in the fall, so I don't even think we really need a hot weather outfit at the moment. Look at all those <laughs> Ooh, that one's loud. Those last two ones seemed really loud for me. Were they really, really loud for you guys? Those two seem so much louder than the other ones. G Sims, that's your all time fave. I like the fun has arrived. That's my new favorite one that you guys can use when you guys get get here. Uh, hot weather. Oh, this does not feel very Betty with the bow. Where's the one? Oh, I guess it's not flagged for hot weather. We're not gonna see her in this one, so I'm just gonna. I'll do her hot weather later. Let's just plop something on her so she's not naked. But we might see her cold weather. So let's see. Because it's like, I don't know, day something in fall. Mm, let's see. Am I missing alerts? I did. It was a hydrate. Thank you for the hydrate. The bit sound is loud to you. Okay, the bit sound, I actually have ability to, I think, adjust that one. So I'll bring the bit bit one down a bit. Cold weather. Honestly, I want you in one of the, I want you in the pant outfit again, but it's not flagged. Cold. Or I could do, oh, we're still filtered by horse ranch. We could do... Maybe like a skirt and a top. Oh no. Oh no. This is my favorite sound. Oh no, I use this one on my TikTok a lot back in the day. <laughs> the oh no one. I won't ever forget water again. I love it. You're on it for me. Hmm. See, it used to act cold even when it wasn't flagged cold. And then after an update like a month or maybe two months ago, it started like actually not working. Yeah, I feel like maybe just something kind of like this for cold weather, but maybe a different skirt color. I don't know. Maybe just something like that. And then we can maybe give her the pant outfit, but it's not flagged, so I'll have to... Whoops, wrong, wrong one. Okay. Okay. Betty, I think you and Wyatt are the only ones who got, like, the most cast time. But if she's potential for air, I've got to love her outfits. Cowboy hats. And then I always see them in game, and then sometimes I see the outfits in game, and I'm like, oh, no, 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 no. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? So we'll see if they all look good in game or not. I keep picking a different hat every single time. Uh, Krista, welcome in. Happy Friday. How are you? It, I love Betty. Isn't she super cute? We gave her some pants outfits. Okay, I think we got all of our bases covered. I'll give her some more outfits later. I don't love this hat. Where is that one that I just picked? Let's 
think I like that hat better. I do know that I can change it, uh, D Sims with Sims 4 Studio. I need to go through a lot of my more common custom content that I like and get it all flagged properly. I need to spend a day probably just doing that. It's really easy. Yeah, I just need to bring like all my custom content in and just like flag all of it. If you fall asleep, I hope you enjoy your sleep. I don't blame you. I had a nap yesterday. I have not been able to sleep the last couple nights. Betty and Frankie can sneak some kisses at the wedding. Okay, where is she? Where's my girl? See, she already is in her cold weather outfit. Why are you? Oh, God. Okay, we're going to cheat away their sadness. They were sad for a little while, but it's not. They They grieved. I'll leave that one there, but we'll get rid of all the... Because we've got a wedding, man. We don't have time for all this. And it lasts like two days. It's like crazy. Um. Okay, let me see you in your pants outfit. There's our girl. Lanaga. Are you bored? What are you, are, you're acting. There's our Betty, confident and cool as a cucumber. I know, I feel bad that I just like cheated it away like it didn't matter. Grief is very important emotion, but we've got to get the game moving along. It just overrides everything so badly. Okay, and then we're going to have to go... Here it comes. Actually, I don't even care if we eat. Maybe what I'll do, because I want to get James' wedding like first away. So let's get Frankie aged up real quick. That's um Betty's love interest and the love, well, I was going to say love child of Drill Sergeant Sims, but I mean, he was a, he was a legitimate child. Love child sounds like a Ill illegitimate child. <laughs> Oh, goodness. So Frankie, we'll just do Frankie's like every day, his formal for the wedding and like his sleep and cold. I, or I'll do one and then copy them. So he's going to be. Where's Boss Hog's household? Because they work for Boss Hog. Are they not marked played? Oh, here it is. Boss Hog Estate. And I need to move the sheriff out of this household. Or is love child a child oh, made in love? I don't know. Let's make you a teenager. Skip a oh, Frankie, you're kind of a cool, cool dude. You had curly hair as well. Where is my favorite? The sheriff just needs to be moved out. I had moved him in. We had like a storytelling thing that had happened one episode that I just kind of wrote off that storyline because I just wasn't. We were gonna we we did the whole thing where like uh Will got arrested. Like Will went and confronted Boss Hog about um the ripping us off for the money for the war and i had uh the sheriff like arrest us and take us to jail for the night and i was gonna do like trial and stuff but i'm just not feeling like going through all that since it's kind of hard to like enact that out in the game so i kind of just was like all right just pretend like none of that happened or it did happen but we don't need trial I wish I had like more curly hairs. I need to add more of my custom men hairs in this save file. I realize like I don't have like any of my Johnny Sims ones. I think I might just do this one for now because I want more like curly and I, he definitely needs different eyebrows. Um, Can we see him as a young adult for a second? Yes. Let's see. Young adult. Hey, Reginu Nobsa. This is as a young adult. This is Betty's future man. He loves her even though all she does is fart in front of him. He needs more chin. Oh, no. 
Oh no. <laughs> I'm gonna have to send them both to you, D Sibs. Or Betty's not gonna Betty's not gonna be able to be the heir. I, I don't mind Josie being the heir either, but she, I just don't she's still young. But she was my first child ever in the game to crawl, so she she's a contender as well. She just has a ways to go before she's older. Um, Frankie, you're looking like... I feel bad, like, thinning them out because it's not that I want them to be skinny. It's just that makes them look younger in the game. So if I can make them look younger without doing that, because uh, I'm not, like, a great cast person oh wait you know what there's those shirts that uh wyatt and james are in that's what we'll put him in these and i feel like he looks really nice in red there's another version of this right here can we give him like lumberjack vibes wait we gotta have a booty okay this is your sim drill sergeant so we can do to do to him if you want him to have a booty we'll give him a booty this is your Sims baby, so you direct me. Because James has no booty. Let's try to match that belt to his suspenders. There we go. Oh my gosh, he's starting to look so handsome. He just needed a good little outfit. He's a cutie. He's going to look good with facial hair too, I think. I just can't stand when they don't have facial hair. But, oh my gosh, look when he gets facial hair. Let me tell you, when he gets older. That's going to look real nice. We need the bubble butt. How do I get rid of the facial hair? But he's still young, so we won't do facial hair yet. Um, Let's give him some eyelashes, though. There you go, bud. Facial hair does, in fact, hide the chin issues. Too bad we can't do that for the females, right? Too bad. What are his traits? Okay, I've got to fix this. He's not a green fiend. He could be a horse lover, though. He's cheerful. No wonder he loves Betty. Um, Jewel Sergeant, do you want to pick out some traits for him? Since he's from your, from your lineage? Let me get his formal. Give him, like, a nice... A nice bow tie. Let's do a bow tie outfit. It's not one with just like a red. Romantic. Okay, we'll go romantic. He's gonna be a good, a good hubs. Bearded lady. I used to get my hair cut at a place called the Bearded Lady. When I lived in Michigan. Ooh, maybe a... Maybe a vest? Is that ruffly thing a little bit, like, too old school? Like, not time period appropriate? Like, is that more like 1700s than 1800s? Let me pick out some pants while I give you experts some time to chime in. I could give him goofball because him being a goofball and her being a goofball would like be really funny. I love goofball. Oh, That's my favorite trait in the whole thing. So let's do goofball. Poet shirt is timeless. Is that what this is called? I think this looks really nice for his formal. Actually, I already like his shoes as well. Um, does he look good with like a hat on? If not, I might just leave him hatless. But I feel like in this time period, they often would wear hats for like nice things you can give him a gambler hat all right there we go that'll work for his formal so they're gonna look so good at the wedding although she's gonna basically be wearing almost the same outfit as him because she's gonna be wearing a uh what do you call it she's gonna be wearing a, a vest outfit and so is he but you know what they love each other they love each other so much what you wearing a vest for your sleepwear no we're gonna just put you in this one in this like beige 
um, for his sleep, and then his cold weather. Oh god, all the accessories, because it'll probably be cold outside. Uh, why don't we give you like a jacket like this? I need to get some more stuff flagged cold for sure. I like these pots. Uh... You never know when you need a vest in your sleep. In your sleepwear. Maybe he hides his Colt 45 pistol in there or something to protect everyone at night. Where are Frankie and Betty going to live? Well, if they become the heir, then they will live on the farm. If they don't become the heir, then we'll have to decide. <laughs> we'll have to find a place for them. Kind of want to put the gambler hat on you here, too. Oh my god, the base of the my neighbor under under it's like shaking my whole chair. But if they I think if they don't if they're not the heirs, I think I'm gonna have them stay living at bosses and say that they take over as like the next generation. I know if we had it, let me look at my other jackets. I have hold on. I have this one. It's not red red, it's kind of like a rusty orangish red. I could do something like this. Wait, we're getting raiders, my sound is not working. <laughs> Why is it not working? When I test it, it works, but welcome in, Raiders! Welcome in! Let's see, I was like, who's raiding us? Charting that a welcome in, you guys. Thank you for bringing your community over. If this is your first time here, I am Shay, and we play Decades Challenge mostly. So welcome in. Were you guys simming? How was your stream? Let's see. Uh, Smarty, welcome in. I love you guys' emotes. Happy Friday or Saturday if you guys are across the pond. But welcome in, welcome in. You guys feel free to hang out for a while or if you have to go, no worries at all. You guys take care of yourself first always. Renee, hello, hello. The raids are so quiet. I used to have a song, you guys, when you guys came in, and it hasn't been working. But let's see. The rust color coat works. It's kind of reddish. Yeah, I think I, I think this is nice. Um, I think I've got the outfits that I'm going to need. Let me just take off. I'm just going to make him naked on these other ones because what I'm probably going to do is, like, copy his everyday outfit, like, over onto um, that one. So let me just give him for their swimwear. I normally just do these like old, these custom content like pants that I have. Uh, let's see. I think I did I pass them up? These ones. I just usually do those for their sleep. And then, oh, oh my, oh my. Let's uh, get rid of all of that. And then we'll copy his every day over to his party. We did a sleep. Okay, athletic. We'll have to copy too. I'll just copy us every day on that one as well. So remind me if we get to the wedding to to do that so he's not like naked. Um. Oh, thanks, Jesus. I definitely forgot to age him back down to a teen. I for sure it's forgot. I forgot. I forgot. Awesome I forgot. You guys are playing floor. Sims, Charty. Awesome. Speedo drill sergeant. No. No. Not in 1870, huh? You're so welcome for the shout out. Naked wedding crashers. I know. I'm going to give him. He wants. To, I'm going to give him soul aspiration since you uh, made him romantic. And then. Um. Oh, he's teen, so I don't have an extra trait. Okay, so his traits are full. All right, Frankie's ready for the wedding now. Frankie's ready, and now Betty can run off and do her shenanigans and, you know, get in trouble or whatever the thing is. So now that that's done, we need to go. This is going to be a little bit of setup, but it's going to be so worth it when we get to it. We've got our Sims aged up. We're going to set up. Should we just do the wedding here? At the Native American lot. 
Begaboo! Welcome in. You haven't really missed anything. We just aged up and made over uh, Betty, and then we made over her love interest, Frankie, so they'll be the same age, and then we're going to get set up. But what should we do? I'm thinking we should do it at this lot. Uh, when does Josie age up? As soon as I, I get her traits um, maxed out, which she's pretty close. She's pretty close. I just want to max all her toddler skills, and then we'll age her up. I'm not following um, the years anymore. It just takes too long. Uh, one of your favorite aspirations is the super parent one. Oh, I we can maybe give that to one of them. Um, it's a very popular lot among the townies because <laughs> I had it set as a nightclub. That was funny. Um, and if we do do the wedding, I was like, should I? Like, what should be the cin centerpiece of this? Because I kind of like design this around this central area, so I kind of feel like nightclub for the tp should i like take away like should i make a little center center area right here and then we can put back their their stuff for cooking later like maybe i just move this like out out to the back <laughs> i don't know i just get it out of the way for a moment um let me have a look at like the arch arches where do you even find that activities question mark like where, where, what category are wedding arches in? Let's get rid of debug. And I'll get rid of custom content as well. Uh, let's have a look-see. Okay, not recreation. I guess getting married is not a recreational activity. Okay, here they are. I had a feeling they were in activity somewhere. So activity miscellaneous. So there's just sort of like that plain base game one. I was thinking like, I know this is probably not like culturally accurate, but we're limited in The Sims. So maybe they just put up some flowers. Let me see. Okay, plop you down. Plop you out of the way. Ugh, I can't get rid of you. Go away. So maybe I'll move these. Off to the side. Just put those out of the way. There's one that is wooden with branches. Oh, is that did that come with horse ranch? Did we get an arch with horse with horse ranch? Oh, but I remember something about that one. It's like not a wedding arch. It's like somewhere else. There's a Sulani one. Let me see. That's wedding stories, wedding stories. There's this one. Oh, this one might could look kind of more. Do we feel like this one might look like something like I like that it's very natural. Like they could have maybe just From my wedding stories. Okay, so there's a, let's pull out a couple arches. I always feel like when I'm in a rush when I'm streaming and I'm trying to not let myself feel like rushed anymore. It's like, no, let's just, we're just gonna take our time and we're gonna do it right. After the wedding, they will shoot uh, bows and arrows. I love it. I love it. I want them to ride off on a horse. I like, I think I'm liking the Sulani one best so far. I kind of want to find this one you guys are talking about, though, with the twigs, but I'm not seeing it in this category because this is, wait, hold on. Is that twigs? No, that's just, oh, wait, is this the one you guys are talking about? The more rustic one? Blend an actual wedding arch with a debug one from the horse ranch. That's, I feel like that's just more effort than what I want to do for this. I think let's just say the Sulani one. Because it's kind of got like a natural vibe. It's fine. Um, I don't want to say their wedding's not important. It's, of course, very important. But I, uh, I can't be bothered in all honesty. My quarter tile on. Is 
Is that central? No. Why does this look crooked? It's driving me crazy. It looks like it's not straight. Yes, they're going to get married right in front of all the food stuff. They are. They are, they are. I kind of want to put like a fire. One of the things I kind of have a vision for. I really don't need these, but I don't know. We'll do something like that. And then I'm not even going to be able to really control everybody. Um, I want... Let's see, I think outdoors. Okay, let's filter by uh, island living real quick. There is, oh, maybe it's actually appliances. This thing. I kind of want this thing for them to do like a ceremony. Like with the, um, I kind of want this like central. So maybe I move. We'll just put a little bit of seating off to the sides. Yeah, because like food is a central part. And then I want to do the kava bowl. Like I think these are the items that are just like the best that we've got to be able to do like what I'm wanting them to be able to do. Does that make sense? We'll just move this over there. So food is a central part. Put the wedding arch in front. Oh, that's a good idea, Rose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me just flip everything so then we watch the wedding from this way with the town behind us. Because I was kind of wondering, like, which way I should do it. Um, we'll move. They can just have two little ones of th this for right now. Okay. So we can do that there. Is the buffet table too modern? Do I even need the buffet table since we're not doing like a My Wedding Stories wedding? I'm just trying to keep it simple. I think I'm just going to go back down to the original two seats. Everyone can just stand around. Because honestly, I'm not going to be able to control mostly everybody anyway. Okay, let me see what I missed. Okay. Just the the, the kava or whatever it's called. Um, kava bowl. Yeah, so we'll do the kava bowl. Should we put the kava bowl near the wedding art now nah, we'll just leave it where it is we'll leave it where it is we'll leave this here so then like after the ceremony everything feels crooked on this lot but it's not it's like perfectly central i think it's because the pond itself is not completely central i'm very into symmetry <laughs> and i need to just let it go so we'll just do food on this thing and then I hope it works out. Um, let's see. Coco81, welcome in. Anything else I should add? Like, should I add something for music so they can dance? Even if it's not technically historically accurate. Because we've got food. Most important thing, they can get married. They got the arch. They can say their vows, whatever. We'll do food to celebrate. We'll do the kava bowl. But I want there, I would love for there to be some dancing. So maybe I just kind of hide, hide a musical instrument. I mean, not a musical instrument. I just kind of like hide a radio on this table. And we just pretend like we don't, it, pretend like it's not there. Um, can I just, just pretend it's not there. <laughs> Just blend it in with everything else. That should work. You can do a group wedding dance on a dance floor without the music. 
Um, I just don't really have room for. A... Do I have an invisible one that's custom? Is there? Is there an invisible? One of the things that I did in my ultimate decades challenge was I shrunk the dance floor down to one tile and it still functions like a big one why not tool mod a dance floor off the lot oh my god seriously they should have drums mel that's so true that is so true rose if i did tool mod it off where would make sense to put it Dance floors, where are you? Is it Esmeri or Smari? Welcome in. Roller rink? No, not a roller rink. Where the heck is... Am I blind? definitely not logic okay apparently it's a creative skill dancing i mean i guess dancing is creative but that i i, I would have thought fitness <laughs> found it finally um let's just say should i put one uh or i could put it here where the arrows are they should have a kit that's called like new Sims on the block and have instruments in it. Oh my gosh, Sim Emily, EA needs to hire you for ideas. That is so creative. Um, Rose, where should I put it? Do you have a thought on that? Like, should I just go off to the side to the front of the pond? Like, okay, hold on. So let me place it down. Like here ish, like kind of like there. I hate how it looks, but I do want them to be able to do a little bit of dancing for screenshots. Okay, glad you said screenshots because I was like. I am not that invested in this wedding at too much, but I do want it to be nice. I do want it to be nice. You've gotten 666 points twice now. Oh, no. I think we're good. I think we are solid. So, I mean, I could have done a little bit more, but it's going to be simple. So, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I could have done rocks. Eh. I'm not going to spend too much time on it. Have we already been going for an hour and 10 minutes? Cast and build takes so long. Thank you guys for sticking with me today. But we had to, we had to do some prep and I didn't want, I wanted to do it with you guys. I was going to set stuff up before, but I wasn't exactly sure what I wanted to do. So I wanted you guys to be able to do it with me. Thank you for the hydrate. I'm glad you guys love it, Becca. Um, I've been telling myself too, the stuff that I'm like worried feels boring, you guys actually enjoy. Uh, so I'm glad you, you guys like would, it. Would you mind just doing a little, Let's save do a little check for me? Safety save. Um, and let's get ready. What time of the I hope it's early in the day and we can just do it right now. Cause I don't care if the wedding goes more into the evening. I would love for the actual like vows to be around sunset. And then, like, the party can keep going. Because that lot is kind of dark at night. There's not a lot of light on that lot at all. It's 10.30 a.m. in the game. Perfect. We're going to cheat everybody's needs because we don't have time to uh, worry about that at the moment. We have a wedding to, to deal with. Okay, everyone, you all get a free pass for today. Oh, wait. James... We only have one last thing that's very important. Should we? Okay, here was my thought. I Should I move James into Kiona's household and we control the wedding from their household? 
Oh, the island living tiki torches. That would be good. We should place some of those down, Rose. Um, your mom is kind of watching. Hi, mom. Everybody do the safety dance. Yeah, so do like we'll play. We'll bring we'll bring James in. And then um, we'll invite the rest of the Westbrooks, but the Westbrooks will just kind of be running around doing whatever they want. So let's go ahead then. We'll move James. We got one last thing. We got to give them a really nice outfit for the wedding. What do we think? I think James, this is where Rose, I think I am going to put James in more traditional dress. And I just, I hope it's not like cultural appropriation, but I just think in this moment that like her family would have like included him and I want him to go more to her culture for the wedding. And then maybe afterwards she starts wearing some Western attire down the line. But for the ceremony itself, I want them in her culture. I downloaded all the cast items that you guys sent early on in the game or early on when we were setting up. So I have a few options. I feel like I don't remember any of them being like that fancy, if that makes sense. James. Did I do this? There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, they're good. Oh my God, look at all these cowboy hats. He would wear something that would represent. Okay, perfect. Oh, yes. Mr. and Mrs. Hooper. We're going to keep the probably the guest list kind of low because I it gets crazy. Like I would love for like the saloon girls and like stuff to be there, but it's going to get too crazy. Or maybe I just invite them all and we just see what happens. Or we can just set it back as a nightclub and let the party let the party <laughs> happen. Okay, so let's just load here. Invite everyone for the drama. It might be chaos, but honestly, it's what we're here for, right? I don't think I have anything head, uh, like any of the head stuff. I don't remember having that in cast. But we're about to go into cast right now. And then we'll put the tiki torches and then we'll be ready to go. Oh, Shania. We can probably not invite Shania and she'll be the first one to show up. Party nightclub. Madaba. Ribiolium. Oh, the only thing is, though, I might have to control Frankie and Betty because I do want there to be a part where Frankie and Betty do run off together. So I'll just use control any sim mod for that. And we'll play from this household's perspective. Okay, I like this outfit, so I'm going to copy that so we don't lose it. And then let's see. <laughs> this is one of the nicer ones I have. It's like more alpha, so I haven't tended to um, use this one very often. We can update her dad. Okay, he has this in his formal. He still looks so young. I mean, he is an adult. He just has such a young looking face. Maybe a nice vest for James. Yeah, we'll have a little play around. I don't think I have anything. I know when I downloaded some of the custom content that you guys sent, I had a couple of issues with a few of the files. So the... If there was a headdress, then um, it might have been one of the files I had to take out. So I don't have like a really nice like chief headpiece. Make his hair even longer. I don't know if I if they have any longer hair. I think we're just kind of limited. There was a headdress. Yeah, I think I remember that that file, it wouldn't let my game open. It was like specifically saying like there was something wrong with that file specifically. Do we do braids? 
I that, that we said that at the same time, Drill Sergeant. D Sims, you'll send me the file. Yeah, I feel like something when I downloaded it. We won't have it for for this. Actually, we might take a break before the wedding. Mm. So I don't know if you're able. I mean, you don't have to do it right now, D Sims, but if you just like have it handy, I could put it in before the actual wedding. We'll be all set up and then we'll we'll do wedding. I like the braids. Or give him the last. Ooh. And maybe changing his facial hair too, because he has his. Th he, this is literally an EA sim. So I feel like I'm looking at images of like chiefs. They do kind of have goatees, it is showing a lot of goatees. Yes, that's kind of the vibe, I think, of the pictures I'm looking at. M like, mustaches with, like, more of a, like, goatee style. Uh, Horse Ranch are the best touties The Sims ever made. And then some age lines. Yeah, I got some. Yeah, he's starting to look a little bit more in line. I thought I had a... Custom content. Yeah, wrinkle overlay. Yeah, something like that. I don't I don't know what the difference of all of these are. I mean I realize there's like summer the head. Yeah, that's good enough. Okay, now he's not looking like he's 18 years old. Now we're on track. Yes. That is the vibe. He just needs his head his headdress now. So what what would be appropriate for James then? Cuz I don't want James in the same outfit, right? But then the only other one that I have he was for sure looking like an 18-year-old with an 18-year-old child. It was. Does... Uh -huh. Like, does James wear something like this? Just a vest? Isn't vest a category? Ooh. Best, yeah, the last Ooh. category. That's super casual. Huh. These are the options, but none of them look super... Like, I like this vest, because this look like this could be, like, tan bison hide, but then it's just a t-shirt under it. This one could maybe be the best one. Oh my gosh, Jersey, eight months. Oh my goodness. Happy eight months. Um, I am gonna have Kiona dress more Western. Like, that's my long-term plan, Becca Boo. But for the ceremony itself, I think they're gonna have a very, like, traditional ceremony to her culture. And so I'm just trying to find the best, um, the best blend. I wish I had this color of the vest, but not in a striped, not in a striped shirt. I'm thinking, I'm overthinking too hard. Ooh. I've started getting to the point where I don't get invested in the weddings because they're always just like a dumpster fire. So I get, um, I don't want to invest any time any into it anymore. Although we're spending the whole stream, so I guess we are invested. 
best. I'm trying to get to the black swatch, bros. <laughs> okay, the black swatch. Your New Year's was quiet, Mrs. Cole. I went out to a concert, so mine was not quiet. <laughs> but I did have a good time. But I would have also very much enjoyed some quiet time. Huh. Becca, but you like the white one and Rose likes the black shirt. I'm trying to see what pants to put. I feel like if he's in black, he's going to clash with the brown. Because Kiona is going to wear we are invested in the wedding of James I'm invested because I'm ready to get get rid of him that sounds terrible but <laughs> I'm just ready to have less sins to control Girl, you have no curves. You haven't played Sims since last year. Oh my gosh. The idiot next door set on fireworks in the middle of the main road. What? Who are you? Who, one of you guys, someone like drove into the transformer. I can't remember which one of you it was, but that was crazy. That's what Stella said when she kicked him out. I'm a terrible person. I am a terrible person. You know what I cut the hair I want to give her? Hold on. The one with the flowers in it. Should we give her like a... Should we? I know this is more like hmm. island living, but I don't know. I just want it to have something like special and ornamental to it. And I don't really have any other custom content. Kind of braids. Hmm. Oh, this is kind of pretty though, with the braid wrapped around the top and like the, her curls done up. I I think that looks really nice. Ask D Sims if she knows. Um, wish there was a braid with flowers. I used to have some custom content ones, but not in this. Safe all. I do think this one's pretty and it is time period. We are in 18. I can't see. 1871 is the specific year we are currently in. We will get to the wedding eventually. I'm working on making... She looks like Frida. She looks beautiful like Pocahontas. I feel like... Doesn't she have like a Frida vibe right now? Yay, g -Sims, Thank you so much. After the wedding, she may do this with her hair as she tries to wear more Victorian dresses. Should I keep it for right now? I think I like it for right now. I think given the like limited options, I think it's fine. Um... Jewelry. Wish I had ones that looked like turquoise. Okay, that's going to be the closest to turquoise. For the wedding, her hair, maybe she would be more traditional, like braids are just loose. Okay. We can... 
There were a couple other. What about like a long traditional braid like that? We are going to, we're going to take a break. Actually, we're probably going to break. The ad is about to run in three minutes. So we probably still have a little bit more prep work to do after the break, but we're going to take a break like pretty much in just a few minutes. So let's like, I'll keep an eye on it. We've got, we can get, a, we can get a lot done in three minutes. So let's keep going um, and see if we can, cause she's, I think that braid on her hair, I think I like that. I just don't have like a really like extravagant, I mean, not that it needs to be extravagant, but I just don't have a very fancy. Um, oh my gosh, Becca, I just saw your message. Giving the dad facial hair has spiraled Annie into reading about the history of facial hair in Native Americans. I love that. If she finds out anything interesting, for sure, let me know. Because I love reading about that kind of stuff. I almost feel like a dress even more like this feels a little bit more like, I don't know. We could say that like the thing that's wrapped around her has like special meaning or something. I don't know. I don't want to say anything that's like not accurate to culture, but like, I just feel like that's common in culture, different robes or different like tassels or things like they represent different things, different colors represent different things. Um, I don't know. This just feels nicer or just the alpha looking in a uh, dress. Her mom is wearing that alpha dress though. So I need a, cause this was the alpha one. Oh, that is, that does look really nice. Yeah. Let's do that. The hair in the makeup with the earrings, like brought it up a notch, but I can take her mom out of that dress. That's an easy fix. That is super easy fix. Should we just do moccasins? A fertility belt to bless the wedding with children. I love that story. Like, we could make up our own culture, too. Like, I mean, I would like to... Um, why did those boots make my whole Sims body disappear? What the heck? Oh, my gosh. Those make my little Sim disappear, too. What is happening? Here, let's just do those boots. Okay, and let's get her mom out of the same dress so we don't match our mom at our wedding. And she can wear... Mm -hmm. Okay, mom can wear that. Mom looks great in this. Were the moccasins good? What other names did I think of for her? The dress doesn't like boots. Do we? Okay, hold on. No to these boots. We like the moccasins better. Jersey, what do you mean? What other names did I think of for her? Like for her first name? Is that what you're asking? Should I do the moccasins? I mean, I think those moccasins are actually created to go with this. Ah. You like the sandals, Rose? I can go back to sandals. I'm happy to go back to sandals. I had these initially. Ah. Okay, DSIM hmm. says sandals too. And if that's what you would do. Okay, so that's fine. Her shoes honestly don't matter that much. As long as they're not like sticking out. Okay, unanimous on the sandals. Uh, okay, the ad's about to start, so let's go ahead, do a quick break, and we'll come back, we'll wrap up the final details, and we'll have our wedding! So, BRB, everyone.
All right. I'm back in the game. It's just loading into the lot, so I'll switch over when it's ready. But um, I want it to come back before because I was going to say, if you guys are interested, I can put this lot on the gallery and I can link to everything in the um, in Discord, all the CC that I used in it. So I can upload it because this is like a like a more unique lot or whatever. And I, 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 I would love to share it with you guys. So I will upload it and I'll probably do like a, I usually make, I'll either make like a Google doc or something that links to everything. Cause I'm not super great at linking to everything in discord. So it'll be faster for me to just like find the files I used and link to it. Um, okay. I'm gonna switch my screen. No, this one will be really easy. Cause I don't think it's a ton of items. Cause I did use some like, um, uh, like there's a lot of clutter on here. So like I'll link to all of it, but if you don't want to download like all the little clutter pieces, you could like clutter obviously with whatever you have in your game. Um, but I'll put the version of it. That's like not set up for the wedding. Uh, cause I already have that one saved in my gallery from when I just rebuilt the save file or I have it in my library, but not on my gallery. So I just have to press a button. Um, and then I'll link to it. I I added the files. So we're going to go back into cast because I had a closed cast to like restart the game. I almost forgot. I like ran to the bathroom and then I came back and I like almost forgot. I was like, wait, 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 wait. I'm supposed to like restart and um, put the objects in. So I think it was like four or five files. I put those all in. So let's go back to cast and see what that added for us. And then we should be almost ready. For this wedding. Frankie requests that him and Betty slow dance. Is that the wedding? Yes. The slow dance is like, I'm obsessed with the slow dance animation. Okay, so let's go to dad. Let's go to your formal. And now let's see what we've got. Yes. Oh my God. I love it. I love it. I think the brown. I think the brown one looks really good. Oh my god, I love this so much. And his braids look so good. Thank you, D Sims. Yes. Okay, that will be so lovely. And then what were the other things that I added? Because I just I didn't even look at what they were. So two of them were the head the headdress. Or were they all head accessories? Is there anything that I should add to Kiona specifically? I think she's good to go. I think she's probably fine. Wild turkey feathers, exactly. This is exactly what he needed. They were all head accessories. The other, there was one for females. Would the mom have one, potentially? She has no eyebrows. I mean, no eyelashes. What is happening? Woman, you need some eyelashes. There we go. Much better. I want to see the female ones. I'm just curious what they look like. Oh, okay, it's just like the same versions, but like... I think her outfit is better without it because she's not as over the top. So we'll leave it for dad. We'll leave it for dad. We'll leave mom like this. And I think we were finished, right? Was... was did, did James get a complete outfit or did I just kind of abandon him? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I abandoned James like mid mid decoration. He has no shoes. <laughs> James is going to be barefoot at his wedding. Actually, you know what? That might not be that inappropriate. Um, do the years progress in my playthroughs? They do. They do. Um, I haven't got far enough to decide if I'm going to take out the old the CC from older generations. I guess I haven't really thought about that because we only started in 1850 and now we're in 1870. I I would maybe like go through and take some of it out depending on how it goes. The first time I did decades, I didn't. I feel like this color white shirt and the tan vest are what are going to look the best with what um Kiona is wearing so I feel like we should go lighter on the aesthetic for him abandoned James I did I was well I was like not I wanted to see what Kiona was gonna be wearing 
Oh my God, the story of James's life. Poor James. Hashtag justice for James. Justice for James. Yeah, the headbands are in... Oh, wait, there's a headband, too. Also in... In hats as well, you're saying? Okay, we'll go back and take a look at that. I think... Should he wear a cowboy hat for the big day? Or, like, a really nice, like... I don't think I like that. I gotta figure out his pants. Actually, you know what? I need to also, I need to age them Branding. both up to young adults because teen awesome. marriage does I'll not, teen marriage just doesn't work for me. I have it flagged that teens can get married and we need them to propose real quick, but Pomeray Quest. yeah, I don't like, I don't like the white and it is too boss hug. Um, but a hat, I feel like he should wear, but just not, just not that one. <laughs> just not something a little more tan where's the actual horse ranch one that custom version of the horse ranch one hmm. um maybe something like that and i just i'm not liking his pants i know i'm probably being really picky but they just it's just, they're just not right should we wear chaps Ooh. <laughs> I I want them to match. Yeah, I want them to match the vest a little bit more. Oh, he's looking a little monotone. Would the chaps be nice? Okay, we say yes to the chaps. <laughs> I think... He is a rancher after all, yeah. <laughs> okay, I think that... That tone, maybe? Um, Here, Quackers, are you here? We're gonna give him just a little bit of a booty. Just a little bit of a booty in his, uh, in his chaps. Okay, and I aged them up to young adults. Oh, thank you, Red uh, Lilin. Thank you so much. That's yeah. fun that you're doing a Regency save. Booty for quackers. Yep, booty for quackers. Um, is anyone else having Twitch freeze every now and then? I've had people telling me that, Becca Boo, um, a couple streams ago that Twitch has been freezing. And I've noticed it's happening, like, when I'm watching you guys sometimes, I have to hit refresh. I don't, Twitch is, like, on one lately. Ooh, Jersey, Cobb Salad. Yum. Wait, Wistful, welcome in. We've been prepping all stream. Okay, is this the outfit for James? I feel like it's not, like, 100% what I would have wanted. But I think it is as good as we are going to get. Yeah, I think that first swatch, color-wise. Color Honestly, the checkered shirt feels the most James. But I don't know if that's... Um, I kind of do want to... We're going to do the red. We're going to do the red checkered. It's it's the most James. And I don't like that teal scarf on the other one. So anyways. The fun <laughs> has arrived. Woohoo. Uh, okay, we agree. I think they're ready then. I think we are ready finally. Only an hour and 46 minutes in. Technically, Betty and Frankie aging up in their makeovers weren't wedding prep, but they were kind of wedding prep because I needed them to be teenagers for the wedding. So the way that we should probably do this then is... Okay, well, first of all, um, this is going to be all so romantic. Wait, why are you tense? Do you have a festering... It better not be with James. As long as your bitterness isn't towards... 
Oh my god, resentful from no prom invite. No, I hate that. It, you always have to cheat that away. Ugh, I'm glad I checked that or the wedding would have <laughs> not been good. Oh yeah, torches. Torches for the lighting because it is going to get dark. So I have to add the torches and then I have to have him propose because technically we haven't done that because they were teens. So we got to just get this show on, get the show on the road. Okay, torches. Are these the ones that you guys are talking about? Or are there different ones? Yeah, I think these are the ones. These are them. Okay, let, let's go into nighttime so we can... It'll look like they made lighting out of, like, arrows. I kind of like that. Put some there. Wait, age. I've aged them up to young adults already. Is that what you were saying, Becca Boo? We'll just put a few here. Technically, the dance floor is going to be a little dark. I mean, I guess, can I, can I tool mod lights? I don't see why I couldn't. Do they still function, though? If I tool mod them? Okay, that's looking... <laughs> and then near the table. I think that feels like too much. I don't think they worked when I tool modded them, to be honest. They do still function? Okay, hold on. Wait, no, no, no. I feel like we're going to need the lighting. So even though it seems like it's kind of a lot, but we're going to need it. Yeah, I aged them up just a bit ago when we were in cast. Because I remembered. I was like, wait a minute. We're not even, like, engaged technically. That's too close. Give us a little bit of room. Okay. Maybe like that. And then... We have a little bit of lighting by the table, but these give off nice light. These are lovely. There, that's fine. It doesn't need to be perfect. It's hard to tell. Yeah, they do look so similar. Um, and then this will have fire. I mean, not fire, but I don't know. I don't know if that will give off any light. I mean, it's still pretty ambient, but... I could put, like, another one in between each of these. Because they don't really need a walkway through these. And then there'll be more light. I think that will... Yeah, there we go. We can see. It'll be fine. Yeah, I figured mom will need to start cooking because it takes, like, a long time, doesn't it? Um, so let's save. There's, like, there's, like, tiki torches everywhere. They're, like, everywhere. It's crazy. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, James, can you... Wait, what is happening? Oh, here we go. Ring what if she says no? I'm going to say that that whole thing we did with her dad was the proposal, not this. Yeah, she said yes. Yeah. Oh, could make it a full moon to add more light. That's like a pro tip right there. Oh, yay! Congratulations, you two. Didn't even see that coming. Didn't see... As the horse runs him over, right? Okay, so we're officially engaged. 
and now we're both very flirty. So how, since I'm not doing a My Wedding Stories wedding, now it's been so long, I'm like, how do I, what's the best way to get everyone here? Like plan an event? Dad, you need to... Get get home. The horse has opinions on the union. Watch out for the wolves. Just a regular party. That's what I thought. Okay, so let's just have dad. We'll have mom get started. Cook feast. Should I do Grand Pit Barbecue Feast? And should we do Island Vegetable Feast? So glad he met her with a good family considering how bad yeah! Star was to him. Aww. Okay, I think I'm going to do Island fetch Vegetable Feast. To throw the party, he will know the... Are you saying he will need to know the guest? Is that what you're saying, Rose? I have a mod that lets me invite anyone, which usually works fine. But if we run into any issues, I'll just do it from James just to be safe. But I should be able to just like, it shows me the list of all of the Sims that are in the world usually. And I'm fine. I wanted to just start now, so we'll just do it from the phone. They're all going to be in their party wear. We'll have to switch them to their formal, though. Okay, good. Mom's got the, got the food started back there. We'll just do a non-goal... Should I just do a kava party? Because we're literally going to do kava. Um, her dad knows everyone since they had that party. Does James's mom know they are getting married? Well, we're inviting everyone like right now. Oh, Stella. <sighs> I don't think we're, I don't think so. I'm going to uncheck it. Should I do kava party or just do like, I think I should do Kava Party and just uncheck it. I don't see why that wouldn't work. If I have a mailbox on the lot just before the party begins. Oh, I do, Rose. We can finally use that setting. I didn't give everyone else specific outfits, though. So they'll just be in whatever their formal is, which is hopefully not naked. Um, okay, let's just try Kava and hope for the best. Um, we'll just say James and Kiona are the hosts. And then here's where it gets really annoying because it literally, it, it is nice that I can invite anyone. We're just going to, it's going to be a lot of people. We're inviting everyone she to, even see, go here. to see what kind of drama ensues. Oh my God, that's perfect for Stella. That one seemed really quiet though. Fanny, Frankie... Um, I'm not sure what Mrs. Hooper, Mr. Hooper is wearing, but, uh, there he is. Nanny Bell. It's going to be all the townies that we made for this world. Of course, our family... Mrs. Hooper. Rusty and his woman. The Coleman's can all come. Of course, Shania to see what kind of drama. Okay, no Stella. I am bringing Frankie's mom and dad. I might have missed Steven, though. I got to go find him because I didn't see him. Um... Okay, we'll do one more pass because I always miss important people. Oh, 
I think I pretty much got the whole, all the townies. Oh wait, Josie, our little Todd. Did you see Steven? I didn't see Steven in the list. Because they should be in order from their... They're an ABC order from their first name, but sometimes they're, like, out of place. That is so fetch. Oh, I do have him. I already have Steven selected. That's because he was next to Stella, so... All right, that is 26 Sims. 26 Sims. I hope I don't live to regret it. There is going to be a lot happening. Oh, wait. I don't think I even selected the sheriff. What's his name again? Warren. Hold on. Did I? Oh, I missed the sheriff. He was right next to Boss Hog. Whoopsies. Wait. Okay, there's going to be a lot. A lot. I feel like I am Where's Red Jack Atkins? Maybe, oh, you know what? I think I need to add him back into the game still. I think I might have missed him because he was in a household by himself. So I might need to add him back into the save, the outlaw. Because Darla. Okay, so this is going to be at the Groves residence. Oh, God. Okay. Hosts need a refrigerator, counter, and an oven. We don't have any of those things. Okay, so now I can click on the mailbox. Okay, let me read what Rose said. This wedding is going off that or it's going to be glitchy as hell. Miss Cole, good night. Thank you for being here for all the prep. Did the sheriff finally run him out of town? We can say temporarily. Okay, hold on. I got to scroll up. Okay, so here it is, Rose. If I have the mailbox just before the party begins, click on it and use MCC and then set dress. Okay, so MCC. That is amazing. I literally just changed everyone into their formal in like four clicks. I'll link this when I post the, uh, when I post this lot, uh, to the gallery and I post it in discord, I will link to this mailbox cause I can't remember at all where it came from, but it's part of the medieval stuff. Um, okay. I don't know. Am I going to need to do that again though with the people who haven't showed up yet? Let's get this party started. Okay, you guys all just kind of wander around. Let me give everyone a chance to show up. Let's turn this on to... Let's try Americana. Oh, is that mailbox from the Yield Cookbook mod? I had no idea. Okay, I think I might need to do that again, unless this is her formal outfit. Where are the Westbrooks? Westbrooks, you're late for your son's wedding ceremony. Here, let's go mix and ming mingle. Ah, I think that is what it is, D Sims. I recognize that name. Don't have the music playing before the wedding? Okay. I will turn it off. Look at Shania. Shania's already talking to the chief. Okay, I want to, I think I want to do the vows closer to um, sunset. So that'll give us time. <gasps> Yay! That is definitely not your formal outfit for sure. And I want mom in her blue outfit. I 
actually her white outfit will look better for the wedding than her blue dress, honestly. So I'm going to leave her in the white one. I did invite them. Look, we're so uh -huh. yes. Are you so proud of us? Oh, or so proud of me? Oh, I didn't see the back of this vest. Look how detailed that is. They're congratulating us. Where's our sister? Mr. Hooper! We gotta make our rounds. We have we have a little bit of time. Good night, Jersey! Wait, where are you going? Why is that everyone standing around the chief, man? Oh no, what everyone is standing around is a very naked Fannie Mae. I didn't get a chance to fix her outfits. She just has a few that are missing. What is the mod to have a super big event? Is there normally a limit to the amount of people that you can invite? Because if that's the case, then I do for sure have a mod for it. And I'll have to look it up because it's one that I've had since like the beginning of time. I should probably go do the mailbox thing again because now more people are here. And I don't think they're all in their formals. Okay, Nanny Bell actually doesn't have like a... Can you copy from someone else's party anywhere? I don't think I actually have that one. There goes mom with the baby. Where's our wife to be? There she is over there. Okay. Everyone's like clustered in this one little spot. I have the more guests one. That's the one I have more guests. Okay, how's this food coming along? I know this is going to be a while. This is going to be... Oh, 29 minutes until ready. Should we go ahead and try to start gathering people? Um, I'm just liking seeing what everyone's doing. Look at all of our tabbies! This is so worth it! This is so worth it! I kind of want to control... I'm trying to find Betty. I feel like... I haven't... Anybody seen Betty? Oh! <gasps> Hold on. There's drama. There is drama happening. Everyone else in town is all over there having a good time. And these two are spotted having some kind of argument. Oh, this is great. If we know anything about Kiona, she's going to run off for a jog right before the wedding. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. You have 19 Sims in your family and had to not invite four of them. Oh, no. Yeah, you need that mod for sure. Madison is momming it up even at the wedding. I bet, I bet Josie, this is going to be fun to just pause and then just like check in on what everyone's doing. Uh, Josie spilt something all over her. And so Madison asked very kindly if she could go wash up her baby. Oh my gosh. Okay, what else is happening? Okay, everyone else is just mingling. I still don't see Betty though. Does anybody see her or am I just blind because she just aged up like, oh, there she is. There she is. There she is. Oh, she's talking to Eli. There's our girl. So I want to control her for the day. Josie uh, played in something not nice. Yes, it was the horse manure. That's exactly what it was. Okay, I found Betty, so I put her in my control. The rest of the family, I think I'll probably leave on their own. Um, where did James go? Oh, here he is. Just making his rounds. Thanks for coming, Mr. Hooper. So we should get married, then food, then party. That should be the order of events, right? Go here. 
I do want to control Frankie, too. I'm going to grab him. I saw him running around earlier. There he is. Okay, because I want them to slow dance later. I don't think... Maybe what the easiest way to do this will be... I'm going to have to micromanage... I wanted the wedding to be at sunset, but honestly, with this many sims, I don't think I'm going to worry about sunset. We're going to go ahead and get ready. Because I don't want the event to end either. Um, Why is my search being weird? Okay, I think I'm going to form a group... With our family, because we can't really control them. So, Wyatt, I'm controlling Betty, so I'll leave her out. Mom. And the Hoopers. Okay. So, you guys go here together. And then everyone else that I can control. I don't care. I just want them standing around. <laughs> Princess, ha happy Friday. Ooh, okay, before we get started, anything else I should do for prep? Okay. Um. Phil needs world. Needs are filled. Good call, Rose. Um, should I get everyone more to the side so I can get better screenshots? I'll get as many of them as I can off to the side. Okay. Who's already eating the feast? Why do I hear... Who is woohooing? Who is woohooing? Someone's woohooing. I'm waiting for them to come out of the tent. I heard it. Where? Where is it happening? Wait, who's not accounted for? Here's Madison. Here's William. They're safe. Who's missing? Lucy, where are you? Okay, Lucy's right there. All of our children are accounted for. Where's Fannie Mae? Where is Fannie Mae and Boss Hog? I don't see Fannie Mae, Boss Hog, or... Oh, no, Fannie Mae's right there. I think it's Fannie Mae and Boss Hog. I mean, not Fannie Mae. I mean, Boss Hog and Darla. They were fighting. Oh! That was so worth it. Oh my god. It made me look bad as hell. <laughs> this is the best wedding ever. Oh my god. This was so worth it. I wasn't going to invite all the townies, but I'm so glad that we did. Oh my god. I'm so glad. Okay. How do I actually get married now? I know. Someone turned the radio on. Off. Get married to Kiona. They are still mad though. Isn't that hilarious? Oh my God. Okay. So should I just do this? Just click get married. She's looking kind of poofy. Okay. I'm nervous. It's time. Yeah, I know. I'm not going to complicate it. That's one thing I've learned is to just be more simple. Where are my... Here we go. Here she comes. Mom, can you get out of the way? Could you step to the side, please? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
Okay, both mothers, get out of the way. Okay, thank you. Oh, look at the like mountains in the background. Mom insists on being here. Kiona does look really pretty. I love this. He's so nervous. I love the aesthetic. Oh my gosh, it was so worth it. Rusty. Rusty's the officiant. <gasps> okay, here we go. Hold on. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Hold on. I'm going to turn my camera off just during this part so you guys can see better. Okay. Let me turn my. Okay. There we go. You guys don't need to see my face during this wedding. Just for right now while we're. Oh my god, our James. I love that wedding art so much. We need the chief to walk into shots. You can just change. Yes, we do. I can kind of cue him to maybe come over here. He's all grown. This was so worth all the preparation. <laughs> Yay. Okay, this has definitely got to be one of the screenshots. So let me see which angle. The colors are so pretty. Just like the whole vibe of it. We're going to have them, I think, try to woohoo right away. Okay, I've got the chief trying to come over. <laughs> They're married! The reshade is reshading right now, it is. We're all freezing to death, apparently. Okay, here comes the chief. Oh my god, he's in the perfect place. Hold on. James, do hold hands. <laughs> Aw, oh, thank you, Betty, for congratulating us. Aw, oh, man, the chief was in the perfect spot. Let's see if we can get a screenshot set up without... Are you guys fighting? Stop fighting. Okay, hold on. You. You. This is what I do when I'm on my own. Okay, we're just gonna get... When the cold feet set in! Wait, did they get a cute sense of it? Okay. Something along... It looks like he's marrying them. Does it look like he's marrying them? Oh, dang it. I, f I pressed the wrong button and I didn't get the screenshot. Sorry. Hold on, please. One more time, James. One more time, because I'm an idiot. Do not move, Chief. Grab her hands, please, fast. Okay, perfect. There we go. Oh my gosh. Okay, don't press the wrong button. It's so good, screenshot. Okay, good suggestion, Rose. Oh my gosh. Let me get my camera back on. Yeah, and this time our eyes were open. That's why I was pr I pressed the button to try to get them in a better pose. And then when I did that, I missed the... Oh my god, I love it. It's party time. Party time, let's go. I didn't realize that they just put the food onto a plate, though. Um, But now what I want to do real quick is replace this object. Now that they've made the food with um I think I want to do this one sorry you guys are going to have to to move cuz I don't want any fires so we'll just spread these out further away 
But then they can like play with fire and stuff and that'll be a lot of light as well. Is this in the best? Yeah, that'll be good there. Okay. Yes, the chief doing a fire dance, exactly. So now time to make the kava. Let's have chief do that. No available counter space. Hold on, I may have to, um, it's gotta be on a counter, I think. So let's, See if I can make this work. Just it. Oh, it's a little bit too tall, though. We'll get rid of laundry for now. Hold on. Just so he can make it. I don't care. We'll just, we'll just plop that off to the side. Just ignore what it looks like. Just so we can get this thing made. Okay, go prepare the kava. Oh my god, mom just farted in front of everyone. Okay, let's go get that. Okay, while you make that, let's see what's everyone up to. James, why don't you give her a little kissy kiss on the cheek or something? Like a real, like a real sweet. You know, it's we're in front of everyone. We want to be appropriate, but I love you so much. <laughs> Why do Sims fart so much? This save file, I've never had Sims fart so much as this save file. I honestly don't know. Um, you like to make them hang out by the fire a lot. It's a really cute animation too. Um, when you have two like Sims in a relationship do the hangout by a or maybe it's just the hangout by a fire animation. Let's save like a hundred times during this wedding as well. I'm probably missing a lot of messages because it's just a lot happening, but this is really fun. Oh, or should Dakota do it? Dang it, I missed. If you were talking about the kava, I just saw that. I've already had the chief do it, but um, exciting. Not Madison watching over the chief doing the kava. You know, she's like watching the process. I am gonna also, I don't want any of my Sims to freeze to death. So let's do, um, if I turn off enabled, Temperature effects on Sims. I think no one can freeze to death. Is that correct? Oh, talking about the fire dance. Yeah, we'll have um, a couple of them do the fire dance. It'll be fun. We'll light the fire closer later in the night. Awesome. No one's going to die because you guys know that Sims like to freeze to death at my weddings. Who was here for that in the last decades challenge? Is this ready? Okay, so... Let's have him. I'm gonna just have the people that I want to get it come and grab it because I don't know who it's gonna call. So of course the wedding couple, her mom should come and grab some. I'll control Maddie and Will for right now, just so they can both come. Okay, and then you guys come. Whoops. And Madison, of course, okay. I was gonna do call to drink, but there's only like 12 servings and I didn't want other Sims that I didn't want to have it to come and get it. Is he supposed to be doing that? What is happening? Why is he sitting on the ground like that? You guys get you some kava. Christmas does go up in flames all the time. Just like the immediate family is participating in the kava ceremony. All right, let's not uh, put those all over the place. Come on. Let's not make a mess. Sure, you guys can be. They were literally putting these all over the floor. Not me having to clean up this wedding. Will is looking too good. I want to get rid of this counter now. Okay, food's there and I'm just going to leave it. Like, Sims can eat when they're hungry. 
Um, man, it's only 4.30. We still have a couple hours before it gets dark. Uh, Frankie? Honey? I gave you outfits for a reason. <laughs> it is dancing time. It is. So let's have James. Can multiple people get queued to slow dance on there at a time? What is why? The Westbrooks, I swear to God. I will save. What is Wyatt doing? Okay. Madison giving Josie a bath was one thing. Okay, the fact that he's taking a mud bath, here's the storyline. We're going to say it's something that they do. And Dakota told him about it. Like, it's like a special bath. And Wyatt was like, I want to try it. And so he's trying it in the middle of the wedding. Ay, ay, ay. Wyatt's living his best life. Okay, I queued up James and Kiona for a slow dance. But first we have to hear about Betty's criminal career, apparently. I feel like it didn't... Okay, yeah. Okay, there it goes. It queued them. So you guys... Let's get... Frankie and Betty over here. Let's get Madison and Will over here. No Clement Frost. Okay. We'll get them going. We don't have any music, though. Exactly. Dakota said it was a tradition. Now Wyatt is, like, making a huge fool of himself for sure. For sure. Or Dakota. Oh, my God. That's even better, Rose. Dakota is pranking him, telling him it's a special tradition at weddings, and he's being naive. Our Wyatt, that would happen. Oh, my God. I love that. Yes. Dakota for sure pranking. I need to get some music. Now Wyatt's over there in a bath robe, and I'm not controlling him. So this is going to be Frankie asking Betty to dance. You're going to ask your wifey to dance. I don't know if multiple people can slow dance at the same time. Mushka Harpene. Oh, they can. I think they can. They can all slow dance at the same time. <gasps> this is so sweet. I wish I would have got some music. Um. Oh, let's get, let's grab a guitar because uh, William can play that. Since he didn't bring his. That's what I did in my, um, I had, I, I had the dad play the guitar in my, um, ultimate decades challenge. That's what I did. That's exactly what I did, but I'm going to let them have their, their little dance first. Did you guys dance? Cause I didn't see it. Do it again. Slow dance with Betty. Come on. There we go. I love seeing all of these. Oh my god, yeah, I was actually going to have Lucy. Oh, I don't have her in my control. All the Sims are going to start getting teeny tiny in my... Uh, where is Lucy? There you are. But... Eli is actually my love interest for Lucy, but I want to see how she hits it off with him. She has a really lovely, um, I really like her formal outfit a lot. She reminds me of the Gilded Age, so it's probably too nice. Okay, you come and slow dance. Oh, sweetheart dance. Oh, I don't know what that one looks like. 
And then will you come and play some blues? I don't know, play something like that. I love this. Here's Betty and Frankie. Get some tunes going. Here we go. It's party time. I don't know who that random out of place sim was, but oh my, they're still dancing. Oh my God. This is so sweet. We need to get James closer. I mean, William closer to the, oh, you got a pic of them. Thank you. Cause I forgot to stop and get a picture. Let's have him come and flirt. This is my best wedding I've ever had in the game because we didn't do my wedding stories. And so now we can just focus on all the other stuff. This is so much more fun. <gasps> Let's have Frankie reveal his crush. Yes, Frankie, come tell her. Girl, I love the way you wore those pants to that wedding. <laughs> Lucy and Eli really do look great together. They really, really do. Oh my God, she farted. <sighs> Betty, come on. He just revealed his crust to you and she farts. But Frankie loves pranks. They're just meant to be, you know? They're just meant to be. Honestly, if Lucy gets with Eli, I kind of want them to <laughs> I was about to say I want them to be the heir. I have literally Okay, let's pause for a second. I think tell me if I'm wrong. I think at some point during this stream, I have said that every child should be the heir at some point today. <laughs> Obviously, I have not made up my mind. Farts is their love language. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, Rose, I have, haven't I? <laughs> I'm pretty sure, I was like, ooh, Josie can be the heir, Betty can be the heir, Wyatt can be the heir. <laughs> uh, I'm a little undecided at the moment. It's because I don't have a standout favorite and I don't really dislike any of them. So it could kind of be like, I could, I can make the story work with any Sim. I just really like Eli. So that's why, but I kind of want Eli. Okay, we'll have, oh, they're so tiny in my control right now. Let's have her do a little flirt and see what happens. Cause I want to get like a vibe. Let's just see. I would want him to flirt with her. Take a shot every time I choose a new air. Yep, that's the new game. That's the new game. Did you guys, you just kind of... Oh, she's so nervous. She told him something about liking his outfit, maybe. Compliment appearance. You look really uh, dapper today, Eli. Oh, he's feeling very flirty. Okay, do a flirt. Okay, we're gonna work on them and then we gotta get to Betty and because we have a lot of daylight and I wanna do all the fire and stuff when it gets dark. So let's see what happens with these two. Very, very juiced. You guys can say drunk. You guys can I'm I'm five in these two. What was that five? What the heck was that? They look really cute together. Reveal crush. She can promise to dedicate a song because she makes music. Promise to dedicate a song. It's kind of out of place, but... Oh, thank you for that hydrate. I don't think I've drank this whole wedding. You do think Eli would be perfect for Lucy? I made him from the very beginning with the intention for her... Wait, can we serenade? Maybe like, um, I don't think they have high enough. <gasps> they can already have their first kiss though. When can we serenade? Is that after? Okay, 
I wasn't going to have... Should we just do their first kiss already? Yeah. Wait, hold on. Not yet. This has to be a moment. This is going to be a good screenshot because there's nothing in the background. Hold on. I'm going to do my little thing that I used to do. I queue them up. Let's see if it'll work. All right. Let's do this. Now the outhouse is in the background. Oh. They're having a moment. Hey. These two are having a moment. Oh, wait. Are we in the middle of an ad? No! No! I haven't been paying attention. Oh, no. This was a good moment. Can we stay paused for 43 seconds so anybody who is on an ad break can kind of be here for this moment? Look at his eyes. Oh my gosh. I'll just get some different screenshots while I wait for everyone to come back because I feel bad. This was Lucy's first kiss. Let's wait for everyone. His face. I hate the first kiss animation. Does anybody have any thoughts about it? Ooh, look at the background. All of the, it looks like Arizona or like New Mexico. Okay, everybody will be back in 20 seconds. Hold on, why we're paused, hold on. Let's go see what all the townies are doing. Let's see what's happening. What are we missing? Why is everyone hanging out around this like one spot? But I, I don't care. Uh, Everyone's just chit chatting. What's Boss Hog? Is he looking at Fannie Mae? Where's the rest? Anybody back here getting a mud bath? Nope, no mud baths. Aw, Keona's talking to Josie! Uh, okay, I think you guys should all be back now. I'm so sorry. I did not realize an ad was starting, but we paused! Lucy just had her is having her first kiss. I pause so we can still kind of be in the in the moment. Dakota needs to have a bigger part. Yes. Maybe once we get to the like fire dancing and stuff. It's just so many sims and I wanted to get the siblings going. So Lucy Lucy just had her first kiss. Yeah, I ship these too hard. How about we make James and Kiona sneak off for a sneaky woohoo while the party is playing? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, here comes the horse. Watch out, everyone. Hold on. I want to, um, Ke I want Kiona. This is a cute moment. This is just really cute. She's talking to Josie. Can you pick her up real quick? Josie's just babbling <laughs> away. Oh, you sweet little girl. Aw. Auntie, Auntie Kiona. Take a deep breath. Now, let's <gasps> achieve our objectives. <laughs> I like that sound alert. That one seems kind of low, too. The horse definitely has opinions on the union. This is cute. Our little auntie, the family is growing. I don't know. I need to get rid of the radio at this point because they're playing. Change it to Americana. Wait, isn't blues an option? Actually, change it to blues. William and Madison, come and give a big hug to her. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. I love these little moments. Oh, my God. I think this is the most fun I've had in this entire time we've played this save file. I'm glad we waited to do this on Friday so we could play later. Wizzle, you thought it was your Sims playing. Congratulations and welcome to the family, Kiona. We're so proud of the man that James has become because he was a little brat. She didn't say that, but we thought it. We thought it. We thought it. Oh, look, William, William was holding Josie. 
and a good night. I hope work goes well tomorrow. Okay, we'll just say William hugged her. Where are, where is Dakota? Not Eli hugging his little sister. How precious. There's so much love going around. So much love except for Darla, who seems to have been pissed off the entire time. She has resting bitch face. Like, she looks mad all the time. Yeah, so Betty and Frankie need to sneak away for some first kiss. And, um, wait, does Kiona have gold teeth? Honestly, she might, but I didn't mean for her to if she did. We should fix that. Um, does she? Kiona, give us a... No, I don't think so. But for a minute there, I was like... Okay, let me read what you guys are saying where I paused. Love how Mrs. Hooper is sitting there on a log. Um, yes, we're... Yes! And look, Lucy's talking to her. Just pausing and seeing what the townies are doing is so fun. Yeah, she just has little cricket teeth. I have, like, custom teeth. Okay. Where's Dakota? Here's Dakota. So yeah, Dakota hasn't really, we, he's been kind of in the shadows. So where's James? There's Kiona. Where the heck is James? He's over here with his siblings. These three. Getting in, see, this is where they're sneaking off. No, you're not going to the bathtub. I will reset you. Here, Dakota, come in. And it's getting late so we can light the fire. We'll make this ceremonial. Let's gather everyone around. Okay, James, Dakota. James is coming over. I mean, Dakota's coming. Tell us it's time to do the fire lighting ceremony. So we're going to head over. Hold on. I got to pause. Go here. Kiona's already over there. They're so small. I can't even see them. Okay, we're going to do the fire lighting ceremony. Lucy's talking to uh, e about Eli to Mrs. Hooper. Probably so. Okay, fire lighting ceremony time. I love how the lights just came on too, right, as we did that. All right. In honor of the, what do we say? Um, maybe it's a male initiation tradition for the chief. Dakota and James do a fire dance to welcome him into the ceremony. Oh, my God, yes. Yes. Okay, Boss Hog, if you can move out of the way, that would be fantastic. In honor of James Westbrook becoming part of, we're going to say, the Chestnut Ridge Tribe. Let's hope nothing catches on fire. Okay, perfect. Successful fire lighting. And then let's have... Fire dance, Dakota, fire dance, and James. Oh my God, I love this so much. He's feeling very confident. He's been preparing for this. We'll say in the background. Where, why are you guys all running off to different directions? Oh no, there wasn't enough room for the fire dance. No, 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 no. We have room to fire dance. Why would we not have enough space? Let's try again. Dang it. That makes me sad. That's the first thing that hasn't worked. Okay, here he comes. There he goes. There. Oh, oh, you've got this, James. It's okay, buddy. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Try again, buddy. Try one more time. There he goes. Second time's a charm. He's done it! Yay, go James! Yeah, I guess we should be careful with them. Uh... Dang, he's really got it this time. I can hear people clapping. Dakota was clapping for him. He's like, you did it. Here, Dakota, go up and go give him a high five. Probably wasn't very 
uh, time period. I don't know when we started high-fiving each other, but apparently 1871. That is so fetch. <laughs> Great job, James. Uh, no you did amazing. And let's see, Chief is gonna uh, shake our hand and officially welcome us. I'm loving this. <laughs> this is awesome. Nanny Bell's dancing. Uh -huh. And then we're going to have to have the teens run off and James go woohoo. Mrs. Hooper is... <laughs> Hooper wants to move into the tribe. No, Mrs. Hooper. I don't think that's a great idea. Welcome to the family, James. Okay, let's go. Shake our hands so we can get some woohoo. There we go. This has gone so much better than I ever could have expected. Oh my god, this is like... Yeah! Oh, this is the best. I just love it. I wasn't going to invite everybody either, and I'm so glad we did. Okay, so let's get them off. I know, she's sad. I'm going to have to cheat that away. That's so annoying when it does that. Hold on. Mrs. Hooper, that, that was so fetch. I love the new sound alerts. They're so good. They're fun. Oh, I didn't mean. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. I hope I don't mess anything up. Cancel. I know I'm going to try to cheat away the sentiment, but I just accidentally went into cast and I hope I don't mess up the event. I Since I didn't save, I think I should just go back to the regular household. I'm so nervous. I hope I didn't mess this all up. This is taking way too long. Okay. No, we switched households. That's what I was worried about. I don't want the... Hold on, let me... Just save. I'm going to do it through the world map and come back into our household. I'm just worried that it's going to end the event. But if it does, I can just restart the event. That's my only worry is that the event will end. But everyone should still all be there. Dang it! I'm always... I click too fast. I heard sounds. It still sounded like partying. I just might have to re-add everyone back to control any sims. Yeah, at least with it not being gold, they won't be upset. Oh, sorry, guys. This was totally my fault. Okay, so now I just want to do the thing real quick with the... Um... This was so cool. Okay, anybody who didn't see me do this earlier because I did it really fast, if you want to change everyone into an outfit type really quickly and you have MC Command Center, just click on a mailbox, go to MC Cheats, um, Sims, NPC, Household Cheats, MC Dresser, change all outfits, and then I want everybody to be informal. So then it literally changes everybody into their formal. They're all in their formal now. It's so amazing, except for Fannie Mae, who has a little bit of a mishap. I need to fix her. Looking good. Looking good. Okay, there we go. And save and hydrate. Whew. Thank you, thank you. I am in the Native American lot. I just have James moved into the Native American lot already to plan it. And so now we need, okay, we need Frankie and Betty. There's Frankie. Where's our little... There's Betty. Okay. And then we're going to have James and Kiona. I feel like we should just have James and Kiona go woohoo in one of the teepees. Even though technically there's people everywhere. I feel like they would come to this... 
Um, I think I might have clicked on it at first, Rose, and then I clicked the other one. Um, would that be weird to make them go woohoo? XOXO Lilac, welcome in, Raiders. Uh, my raid sound is not working. So uneventful. Uh, but welcome in, you guys. How was stream? What do we think about just having the woohoo in the tent? While, while I give you guys a second, because they are tents, they shouldn't be embarrassed. Okay. Well, if something negative happens, I'll just cheat the moodlets if I have to. But let's see. Okay, let's get the, the, the wedding... The bride and the groom. Oh, wait, James, I want you in your other formal outfit. Your wedding outfit, this one. Okay. Where is Kiona? You guys were doing casts. Were you guys doing like any sort of specific theme or anything like that? We're having a 1871 wedding and it's been amazing. All right, Kiona. Your man's is it? Oh, she just walked. Kiona just walked straight through the fire. Maybe that was part of the ceremony as well. Was uh, the woman has to walk across hot coals before the man takes her to his wedding, takes her to bed for the night. Um, it was for your new legacy. Super fun. I know she's a firewalker. Okay, let's go ahead and. Do some cute little animations and then send them on their way. Am I the only one who like really likes to queue up like certain stuff that. Oh no, before they do, can they cozy up by the bonfire? Because that animation is really cute. Bye, Wistful. Tell Beckafoo I said hello. I'll be over there after we wrap up here. Look how cute this is. I love the cozy up by the fire. And I like taking the pictures like with the fire, like kind of like. Oh, it's so cute. I love it. I'm too, I'm obsessed with this game. Obsessed, obsessed, obsessed. Monica, bye bye. Have a good night. Uh, Wyatt also went through the fire. Oh gosh, we have some fire walkers. Okay, let's do a little. Okay, let's be appropriate while we're in front of everyone else. It's been so fun, Monica. It has. Illusory Throb, welcome in. All right, this is a long animation. Oh, they're so cute. The newlyweds. I have individual fertility on now, so I don't know what her chances are, are for pregnancy. Time for great kids! Hey, let me see real quick. You were just building for a YouTube playthrough of the Decades Challenge starting in Chestnut Ridge as an old west town in the 1860s. Well, you are in the right place, my friend. We started Wild West Decades in 1850. You are for sure in the right place. You are going to have a blast. It has been so much fun. This is our first wedding for Jin to break out the kingdom. All right, you two. The TP yeah! is rocking. Don't come a knocking. Okay, let's get uh Betty and Betty and um. Stop talking to Shania. Okay, let's get them going off over on the side because we got to get that relationship going too. Look, Lucy is here talking to Eli's. Eli's mom and Eli, they're just chit-chatting. I love that uh, Rusty. Rusty is probably wasted. Rusty's had a ton. 
of alcohol or a ton of whiskey shots and he's like made like a bet that he can uh hit the bullseye blindfolded or something like that well we're gonna go a bit later tonight we'll go i i only schedule three hours on friday but if i'm feeling good i go longer so i don't know exactly when we'll end but i'm not ready to end the wedding yet so we'll um we'll definitely go longer than three hours but i don't know exactly how long we'll go look madison's reading to josie in middle of the wedding okay so they're still woohooing i think did you guys make it over here get back over here these two goofballs are sneaking off during the wedding get back over here frankie i was too slow for you and you ran off it is the beauty of friday uh and saturday night streams rose um, let's go ahead and get these two. We've had lots of romance happening at this Aww. wedding. It's been great. She's gonna tell some joke about something. Oh, of course Frankie likes deception. He's so impressed by this woman. Oh my gosh. Oh goodness. I forget. Oh my god, look, and now they're teasing. They remind me of Maya and Jasper from Ultimate Decades a little bit. They're like goofballs. Oh, this is great. Okay, let me see. Uh, Gotta get the most out of those two hours of prep. Honestly, I was feeling nervous that we were taking too long to prep for it, and I'm so glad that we did, because this has been so worth it. Um... You wrote an o your own version. I wrote my own version, too, for this one as well. I made up my own rules. I think that's the best challenge is when you make up your own ru rules. Kind of want him to do that again. That was, like, hilarious. Monzo. And I like that she's just picking at him. He's nervous. It's, it's time to make your move, Frankie. Oh, he is trying to impress her. I know it's kind of dark over here, but now he's showing off his little muscles. Here, do that dance again, because that was hilarious. Okay, now I'm ready for it. Underneath the night stars. Get it, Frankie. He's picking up what, uh, she's picking up what he's putting down is what's happening. Oh, and he just quickly went in for the kiss. <laughs> I love this so much. I love that they just keep, that she just keeps picking with him. I totally ship these two too. The way that they're just joking with each other. I need to do another Phil house Phil needs because um, everyone's starting to get everyone's needs are getting crazy. <gasps> James has been feeling really calm and cheerful lately. Has James learned to temper down his hot headed behavior? You guys. Um, yeah, as far as like promo stuff, you guys definitely put that stuff in like um, the discord. So you're welcome to join there and share any of the stuff for like your challenges. But otherwise in stream, let's try to keep it to um, the topic of this stream. Wait. What sound was that that someone just played? Do I? I added so many new sounds. I was like, wait, why are there children cheering? <laughs> Um, guys, James isn't hot-headed anymore. Hold on, I need to refresh my chat. There it goes. My chat was kind of frozen for a second. You guys are back. <laughs> um, love this for James. Yes. Oh my god, Kiona is cheerful now as well. They both had such an amazing wedding. All right, these two... Do a little bit more smooching, and then, um... Do a little bit more, oh. a little more kissing. Well, Get over here. Yeah. You guys gotta realize, uh, no, no, no. Now we're gonna be kissing in front of everyone. Oh. 
Hold on. Someone or something is dying. I th oh no, it was the it's the self discovery. I was like, why did my camera just jump to them? I thought something was dying. Truly ready for married life. James is a new man. Madison turned him around. They're juiced and don't care who sees. I know. Let's just see what happens. Oh no, they're still a little bit off to the side. They're still behind everyone. No one's really looking. Madison is though. Look. There's mom. Mom is looking. She's got her eyes straight on us. Yes, she does. <laughs> she sees this inappropriate behavior. Moms don't miss a thing. No, they don't. Okay, what else should we make happen while we're here? It's 1.30 a.m. I'm so glad we started this wedding at like 12 o'clock because we've been able to do everything I wanted. Um, Lucy's got herself a little boyfriend. Betty's got herself a little boyfriend now. Um, Betty, I mean, uh, oh my God, Kiona, you're not doing laundry on your wedding night, honey. No, 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 no. You don't have to do that right now. Oh my gosh, thank you for hundred bits! Thank you! Wait. Oh my god, Betty has an official major crush on Frankie. We love that, we love that. She knows her daughter takes after her husband. Sometimes you get juiced and do laundry too. I love how you guys are saying juiced today. Aw, oh, so much me romance. Meanwhile, Wyatt took a mud bath. I know, I know. Speaking of, where the heck is Wyatt? There he is. He's hanging out with his with his siblings. I know Wyatt didn't get any love, but that's because I think Wyatt is going to realize that he is not into the ladies so much. Thank you for the hydrate. She is going to be an amazing mom. She is. Okay, I think we're close to being able to, like, wrap this up. This was, like, amazing. <laughs> Betty needs to come. Does she know? Let me have her meet uh, Steven and Nanny Bell. So that way Betty knows Frankie's parents. Because they're going to need to be, like, chaperoned. Although those two probably won't worry about being chaperoned. I want to put... I want to, um, hold on. Why can I not find her? Here she is. I want to, uh, put a thing where she can sneak out of the house. Frankie's parents did not see the kisses. No, they did not. Really nice to meet you, Mr. Mayfield. Go meet, go meet her mom. Oh my God, I can hear fireworks outside. They're so loud. Okay, go meet, go meet his mom. You you were already kissing and you haven't even met his parents. Let's go, Betty. Oh, there she is right there. Hi, Mrs. Mayfield. I just think your son is so swell. <laughs> Dancing Yoshi, it was amazing. This one is, I can honestly say, is worth watching the replay. I honestly think the wedding was so much fun. I hope you guys have had as much fun as I have because I've had so much fun. It really came together really nicely. We prepped for like two hours. Um, oh, okay, this is perfect. Everyone's saying they have to go. So it just ended. Where's the chief? Oh, he needs to change his outfit real quick. Hold on. I'll show you the chief. This was our bride's father. Oh, my gosh. I'll show you the screenshot real quick of the actual um anybody who wasn't here earlier for the actual wedding we got a really really nice screenshot of the actual like wedding so this was them getting married it was so nice it was so nice betty would totally say something respectful and proper betty 100 percent knows how to be respectful and proper but it's not like 
really her true self. So anyways, this is what it looks like. And it was, we've just had lots of stuff happening. Lots of stuff with all the Sims. Now everyone's leaving. We're gonna, we're gonna head out. We're gonna, actually, we're probably gonna, I, we're honestly, we're right at three hours. I think this is probably where we'll end it today. Cause that was, that was a lot. That was fun. I feel like I want to just like ride the high of that wedding. Look, Mrs. Grove is telling everyone, thanks for coming. Everyone get home safe now. Don't ride drunk. Don't ride your horse drunk, y'all. Call a designated carriage, everyone. Let's see. Yay, lots of pictures of the Discord. And thank you for all. From uh, Princess Robotive, a uh, robotive. If I'm, am I saying that correctly? And D Sims 300 bits. Thank you. Oh my gosh, I this has been so much fun. Oh my god, are we are we are we hype training as we end this? Are we ending with a with a party? Oh my god, Rose with 100 bits. <laughs> 100 more for Princess Robotive. Sexy Black Bass, 100 bits. Thank you, guys. We've never, I don't think we've ever had an end of stream hype train. I'm just gonna go to my chatting stream while we just hang out. If it'll go. There it goes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't even keep up with the alerts. Was that Rose with 100 bits? Did I miss anyone? Oh my gosh, D Sims with 500 bits. <laughs> you guys. Sexy black bass with 100 more bits. Oh my gosh. And five gifted subs from Rose. If you guys are in here, Crafty Simmer for life. The song won't stop. <laughs> Let's see, I don't know. Is that Han Kang, Techie Lib, Ella Nightmare? My eyes are blurry. I'm Jennifer. Littifer, if you guys are in here. <laughs> I can't even count the bits, but Rose, Jesus, I think that was what, 300 more each, Nancy Yoshi with 100 bits, bits, 100 bits, it's a 40, it's a 40, oh my gosh, I'm losing my mind right now, <laughs> I'm overwhelmed, I'm overwhelmed, yes, you guys have broke me, you broke me, I can't even keep up. I can't even keep up. Oh, uh, I'm gonna cry. I had so much fun, you guys. You don't know how bad I need this in my life today. Oh, you guys are amazing. <laughs> so much music. <laughs> oh my god. Jesus. Five gifted subs. So the bits, I can't keep up with the get bit notifi notifications, but oh my god, decent dan dancing Yoshi, sexy black bass, and Rose, and oh my gosh, all of it so amazing. Princess or photo for 100 more bits. Thank you. I am broke. I'm like, oh my god, yes. By D Sims. Where are you guys? I can't even see the leaderboard to see between D Sims and Rose right now. You guys is <laughs> friendly competition. What level? Level four complete. <laughs> We're just vibing. We're just vibing. You fed meaning to Wisteria! Wisteria, how are you? You fed meaning to watch it. If it hasn't found the top, no worries. Tonight's stream was really fun. Even if you only like, if you just start it from where we're at right now, we're starting like Gen 2, I could just catch you up on the rest of it. You don't have to feel the pressure to catch up. Just pop in and we'll catch you up. That is so fun. We are partying. Oh my gosh. Sexy Black Bass with 100 and then one 500 more bits. Decent with 200 more bits. You guys, where? What are the goals? You guys keep breaking my bit goal. It's like the screen's not even big enough to show. 
It is Friday night. I should have got a that cider so out of the fridge fetch. for this. I should have for sure got a cider out of the fridge so we could toast. We're partying. We are partying. It is Friday night. This is probably a good time for me to tell you guys that we're going to, I think, does anybody know? Becca Boo is on, Take right? Because I think a couple people have left now, to go hang out over there. Um, we're going to go raid Becca Boo in just a minute when we end. Since it's Friday night, I'm going to be hanging out over there after anyways. So once we're done hype training, we're going to go... We're going to go surprise Becca Boo. And I think she's going to love it, hopefully. Um, does anyone know, is she doing 100 Baby right now? Or is she doing... Um, Rex the Riches or something else. We're for sure going to raid Becca Boo. And then it helps me practice raiding because I don't know how to raid very good. Um, kicking the cans down the street. I don't, what does that mean? I need some juice. Yes, I do. I'm missing all of it. It's a send off after that amazing wedding. Thank you. That was, I, that was such a good wedding. And I'm so glad we took the time because I was feeling bad that we took like two hours to set it up. I'm missing all of the alerts, but since we've walked past four to this, we 200 bits. Oh my gosh. A hundred. I don't know. You guys just like a billion, a bazillion bits from all the people. <laughs> You guys are amazing. You guys are amazing. Ugh. I just love you guys so much. I've been going through so much lately and I've been having a rough time and I have not been able to sleep. It's just been a mess. And just like, I kind of forget about all of it while we're playing Sims and I just have fun and I love it. And I'm just so grateful for you guys. Oh my God, we are not gonna try to beat the record tonight. We're gonna, we'd be here for an hour just hype training, trying to beat her record. Oh my gosh. Dancing Yoshi, I'm so glad you found stream too. We're so happy to have you here. Oh my gosh. I feel like I should turn the game back on while we're just sitting here. You guys don't want to just stare at my face for an hour. Oh my goodness. Uh, yeah, unlike the 1920s wedding that we had to literally write into the, the story that it was a nightmare because it was literally so bad. Like, worst wedding ever. This was the best wedding I've ever had in the game. Like, and I was only going to invite family at first, and I'm so glad we invited almost 30 Sims. And it was amazing. These, t I think it helps that we were on this like outdoor lot too, like a small outdoor lot. Everyone could kind of mingle. I don't think it was overwhelming for the game to route Sims to things to do. It was so good. Never using my wedding stories ever again. Never again. Thank you for more fancy <laughs> Sims and sexy black bats. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Are we on level five or are we trying to get to level five? Because yeah. I didn't do my level five alert. Yeah, no more wedding stories ever. Never, ever, ever. I was completely happy with how it went today. Just like having the Sims stand around. Like that was so much better. We already are level five. Oh my God. And now I think we're level. Oh my gosh. Bros, thank you for gifting a sub to Wisteria. Wisteria is one of like my OG yeah! like people that came at the very beginning hanging out in stream. Like Wisteria has been here since the very beginning. So I'm so happy that you gifted a sub to them. Oh my gosh, level up. Guys, I'm ready to raid Becca Boo. I don't want to abandon you guys, but <laughs> we got we to wrap up this hype train, you guys. <laughs> Save some love for Becca Boo. Um, and oh my gosh, D-Sims. Wait, Quackers. You have a gifted sub from D-Sims. I love that. Wait, is Fanny Mae? Wait, I was like, I'm not on the game screen at all right now. Um, yeah, we'll let the train timer run out before we, before we um, just let it. You guys <laughs> with the chaos. D-Sims, thank you for 304 bits. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I guess now's a good time. I am behind on uploading these replays to YouTube, but I am going to get caught up this weekend. So you guys can always catch the replays there. Ultimate Decades Challenge. I'll be getting back to um, episodes of that soon. I just haven't been in a content creation mood lately, but I'm starting to feel better. Thanks to you guys. 
Um, so there'll be more episodes of that soon. And then I want to start posting some more stuff now that I'm part time with work, but I haven't quite decided what type of content I want to post yet. So whether like, I don't think I want to do like a full blown Let's Play series. I want something that's I think I might take the Explore series and do some of that on YouTube. And sometimes we do it on stream and that be like a little bit more of a flexible series. So I think I might be doing some of that. So that's kind of an update, I guess. Um, but yeah, basically just the story is you guys are amazing and don't ever forget that. And I love you guys. And yeah. Oh my gosh. What a good night. What a good night. I feel like, oh my God, I can finally catch my breath. The, the, the music has finally stopped. I was about to like, <laughs> I was about to have to take my headphones off. I couldn't take it. That was a party. Oh my gosh. So are you guys, are, are we, are we finally, are we ready to, are we ready to calm down for a minute and we're going to raid Beckaboo? Um, let's get a raid message for Beckaboo. We can write something spec. Let's do something specific. Cause we know where we're going. Let's do. We. Is my heart a follower alert? I'm follower emo. I think it is. Hold on, I'm typing. Why don't we do something like this? Why don't we just come in and say, we love you, Becca Boo. Or we could do like something else. But I think the, hold on, let me double check. My heart is a follower emote, I think. So everyone, as long as you're following, you should have the hearts. Um, so you can just copy that message. I'm still learning how to do this. So you guys just bear with me while I find the raid button. Raid a channel. Okay. Yes. Okay. Becca Boo. Okay. I'm going to click start raid and then I think you guys will be able to click in. So you guys either spam the we love you Becca Boo or all the hearts when we get over there. And then you guys can hang out for as long as you want or if you have to go because it's late. No worries. I'll be over there hanging out for a while. Um... Okay, it says ready to raid in 10 seconds. So I don't remember how this happens, but if I disappear, I love you guys and good night. Okay, ready and let's go. <laughs> 